you got him? No. Oh. No, I didn't. I didn't get him. Oh shit, oh shit, no, 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 shit, shit. Alright, we back. We back. We back for we back for for the real Nork show. How you doing, Kale? What up, man? Uh, what up, man? All right. Uh, now I don't remember what I was doing 
at uh, this point in Mass Effect 3, but I guess we're going to find out. Oh, that's right. I think I just, like, sorted out the, the, the Krogan stuff, hadn't I? Yeah. Yes. We're above Tachonka. Uh... Do it up, though? Nah, we're good. Alright, so we're going to keep going. Yeah, how's everyone's day? Going on. <gasps> Cerberus Fighter Base. Yep, let's go. Let's go and wreck some servers for a little bit. Oh, okay. Noveria. The Cerberus Fighter Base. Noveria was a planet we went to in episode one of this fucking thing. Mass Effect. Noveria, Noveria was Noveria number one? No, Noveria was two. Uh, two. Well, let's let's have a girl's night again. I think Novaria might have been number two. Uh. 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 Eh. No. Yeah. Commander, the enemy has a strategic advantage in this sector thanks to the fighter squadron facility you're about to attack. What was Novaria? <laughs> oh, I'll go in the back, all right. Don't have to ask me twice. Ugh. Oh. Let's go. Let's rick it and roll it. I was kind of hoping that they'd show me a bit of the environment so I could remember, like, what planet this was exactly, but... And what we'd already done here, but I guess we just did a. Oh man, they are eating it. Okay, we good, we good. All right. Man, that just really is like cockroaches. They are the human cockroaches of space. Like, they're fucking everywhere, even when you don't expect them, and then you just have to kill so many of them that by the end of it, you're wondering if it's worth it. <coughs> or, <coughs> you start sneezing. You know, whichever comes first. Oh, man. Oh, hell. oh we going for it tonight. Oh, we going and diddly bone. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, man. Alright. Uh, no, Novaria, I think, was the first game. And I feel like this is where we sorted out the Rachni stuff. Damn it. This will take a while. Commander, you've got enemies in the that we can't wait. Someone's got to get those defenses down ASAP. Edie. Edie, front and center. As you command. Because it's almost like you're an AI. Be ready, Commander. You're going to get swarmed. Got to do computer things. Use the AI. Man, them are they fucking gassy poppy. I'm on it. Oh shit, okay, I was stuck on the wall. Uh. 
Alright. Okay. And that's where we need to go. That's where we're gonna be. Ooh, what is this? Ah, uh, Sergeant Parker, all the base personnel in process interrogation pro integration pro. Mm. That sounds pretty gross. Oh, pistol stuff. Oh, that's right, I got the spike thrower. Oh. Spike thrower doesn't help for miss. Really doesn't help for miss. Ah! Nailed him. Okay. What are you... Oh, there was a guy up there. Oh, there was a guy right there. Bonk. Man, I want to fly one of these things. There's always something coming my way. I'm just that sexy. Okay, maybe we do need that out now. Oh, there we go. Anyone wounded? Only minor injuries. Oh, you're okay. Right, so we, hang on. So we just went there, turned stuff off, and then some other guys turned up and did that. Okay. This was a major victory, Commander. A crippling blow to Cerberus operations in this sector. Now all we have to do is maintain control of the facility. Cerberus won't make that easy. And we won't make it easy. <sighs> Thanks to you, we can use their own defenses against them. Tell your team they did good, Commander. You should be proud. Thank you, sir. That's all. Hack it out. Cool. Back on for 13 minutes and I already sorted a really important cool guy mission. Whew. Okay. I don't like this going back and having to walk through these again, but you know. Yeah. Unread messages at your private terminal, Commander. All right, in trainer. My project. Working on something you'd like to show me meet in my quarters. Yeah, it's fine. Hope leaves from Erdnaut Picara. Command, I'm running to you from the Keflik Valley on Tachanka. See it. Krogan, planet. Count, free, age. Fear, pain. Fate. Store. Reapers. Future, 2,000 years, yep, cool, cool beans. Okay, schmapped and schmabbin, see what Liara wants. <clears throat> Liara, you had something you wanted to discuss in my cabin? Yes. I'll wow, that is a up. dirty vest. What the fuck is that? Is that like a... A keep warm cup for ramen or something. Thank you. Could we sit? Like something that you've, you know, you've gone and gotten your takeaway with and you can keep it in that container. I've been thinking about the knowledge we gathered on the Reapers and how easily it could be lost again. So, 
I put a plan in motion to preserve things for the future. I mean, you know, the Protheans had that idea too, which was handy. What's this? A record of the galaxy. Information on the Reapers, relays, different cultures, and blueprints of the Crucible. I mean, it's, it's not a bad plan. I wanted your opinion on. Which one? Your own. Well, so you probably want to make more than one. We had to fuck around quite a bit to get what we've got from the Protheans. Have your input. How would you like history to remember you? Uh, just be honest. Put down the truth. Good, bad, don't leave anything out. Let history be the judge. That's pretty much how I work. Let me just delete all these breathless passages on your heroics. <laughs> you writing anything I can't live up to? I can't help myself. You're a good friend, Shepard. It's good to have a crew I can trust. Maybe we don't always say it so plainly, but... We're proud to be here, Shepard. Yes, I'm shutting you down, Liara, because I want to see if I can bang Jack again. Thanks. <sighs> cool beans. <clears throat> oh, it's my... E Squeak. He's the best space hamster I've ever known. Whew, okay. Alright, what do you want? Special strength? Nothing. Okay, hang on. Journal. Journal, journal, journal. Uh, how it requires your assistance. Locate Arya's couch and send the coordinates back to Harrod? What do you mean? Citadel. Citadel. Oh yeah, it says Citadel. Benning's evidence. Uh, 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 where is... Dominic is over looking for evidence to unlock during the mission on Benning. Okay. <coughs> no, okay. I've got a bunch of stuff to do on the Citadel, so I might just end up there, even though it's got like, you know, a priority mission. I don't, I don't really want to do the priority missions whenever I first see them because, you know, I like to do all the extras. <laughs> but, haven't really got a lot to go on on Benning, because that could be like a planet within, within many layers of many systems. So we won't worry about that right now. We're just going to go to the Citadel now. I've got to... Well, that is very loud, actually. Give me a sec. Obviously, let me know if after I do this, if the game is too low. And I will adjust accordingly. Ugh. Okay. The, the Solarian Council can kind of just get fucked for now anyway, but... They say no. Oh, something's gone wrong. Alliance Control, this is Normandy. We're headed to Bay 1 Ford, the Kara Ward. Are we clear to descend? Ha! Okay. Alright, bit more bullshit than I expected. You probably should have checked that already. No, 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 no. What have you got? Hey, Salon, how you doing? Emergency message playing on loop from a comm tower. To all incoming ships, the Citadel is under attack. Do not attempt to land. Cerberus is controlling all docks. So it's time to kill everyone from Cerberus. That sounded like Commander Bailey. Yes, it did. Commander. 
Uh, you know what? Let's fucking take Garrus this time, because, you know, he's Garrus. And, and I'm going to check. No, we're going with the tank armor still. Uh, no, it's not even Twitch. Yeah, probably Twitch gets a little bit unhappy if you jump off and on uh, too regularly, so. Actually, I don't know if, uh, hang on. Before we keep it going, I might just put a little boopy doop on Discord. Since you've reminded me of that, since Discord appears to be not functioning at the moment. Uh, where are we? Do we have a? We do have it. Sorry guys, I know this is super exciting. Oh, yep. There we go. Not even Twitch, shitlord. I feel like that's in reference to something, but I'm not sure what I called a shitlord then. <laughs> uh, I wish I wish I knew, but I've forgotten what I called a shitlord. No, that's the highest damage. That's realistically what we want. You know what? Take the Argus. Garrus, take the Argus. And then... Is that the... Hang on. So I'm for the Asai Resistance. The Acolytes, Varels, Fire, Advance, and Ammunition, similar to an Impact Trigger, Resident Warp Bomb, which has a zero sense record on Shields, Mordic Barriers. What about the Scorpion? Yeah. Uh, low velocity squasher projectiles with a dual use high explosive filler within the projectiles and adhesives. There we go. That's what I wanted to chuck on it. Yeah, Neonics demand a paint, which I made. <laughs> oh no, that's all good, man. I just yeah, I just figured I'd better uh, go chuck it somewhere. Because yeah, I think I'm pretty sure Twitch has a little bit of an unhappy if you uh, log off and log on again, so it doesn't like to send out another notification. Because I don't think it likes to send out like. I think Twitch goes, you've logged off and then logged back on within an hour or so. Something must have gone wrong and everyone will just be waiting for you. And it's like, no, Twitch, no. That's not always the case. Okay. All right. Run, lads, run. We'll be there in a second. We'll kill everyone. Or not. Those guys are fucked. Fucking Cerberus. Bailey, no! Okay, people, coming in hot. Get to cover. It's a good thing we waited for everyone to die. Okay. You know, I'm feeling a little bit cocky at this point, actually. Don't get me wrong, I'm sure it'll end badly for me at some point, but right now... I'm feeling a little bit like I have a lot of these guys on lockdown. What up, Bailey? What up, Commander Bailey? Bailey, how bad are you hurt? I'm all right. It looks worse than it is. How about time some cavalry got here? How bad's the situation? He's me six. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought me six was just like a a go button kind of thing. 
Oh, but you can get that paid one, can't you? Yeah, yeah. If no one interrupts me with a bullet this time. Silly AI. Oh, you uh, you keep uh, you keep going on for a while with the uh, Fortnite Lego, uh, Neon City. I've killed most of everyone's Cerberus friends. But that's insane. Does he even have this kind of pull? Dean has got fuck all pull. The in there by Who put together that security detail? And Bailey. and get him out of here. He has got to know more about who's behind this. He could be in the executive's office. It's a fairly defensible position. I love that armor on Garrus. Just a sec. There. Now we can talk by Omnitool. Go. So I think that, that armor must have been like a pre-order bonus or something for back in the day. So I don't really remember it. Well, no, I do remember it, but I don't remember like where it would have come from. Also, I spent too much time today playing Fortnite and obviously some... Too much time playing uh, uh, other games in the meantime. I keep pushing X to try and use things. That's not how this worky dirks. Shot your foot! Shot your face! Fucking turret. Yes. Oh. oh, geez, that dude got turned into paste. I don't know which one of them killed him, but he turned him into paste. Like, that was, like, I, um, I watched a, uh, uh, what was it, um, a documentary on YouTube that someone had put together, and it was, uh, I think it was by UEW something, uh, but anyway, it was like, it was called, like, I read it initially, and I read it as the hardcore killer case. I was like the hardcore killer case, and the the photo was like a, a like an early two thousands like you know pink hair chick with the uh, let's be real the the like the stuff that I kind of like go yeah that and I was like okay so is this like about fucking hardcore music was this this like what was going on? Is there like a singer? Is there a, a whatever? No. But it turns out that it was actually called the Horrorcore, um, the Horrorcore case. And it was actually about like the, the killer perpetratory asshole was, uh, like, uh, let's just continue. The perp perpetratory asshole, like murder pants. Uh, was a dude that thought he was a rapper doing a genre of music called horrorcore. Now, I'm not gonna say 
that it was a good thing you did those murders, but kind of got me to listen to a bit of horrorcore today, actually. So, you know, I've found some new music to listen to, which is nice. Was there another thing? I swear there was another thing. Oh, whatever. Hey, Snippy Rifle Extended Barrel. Snippy Rifle Extended Barrel. Uh, let's... Where are you, Garrus? There you are. Yep. And then let's modify. Okay. Yeah, buddy. There we go. You got more damage now, man. Accuracy. Uh, more damage. Oh man, have I not done that? I haven't done that for Edie either. Shit. Okay, we good. Now let's continue murdering all the service agents. None yet. Keep Man, C-Sec's like their little private police force, so... If they've been fucking decimated, these guys are going to have a lot of problems. Just in general, even after I save their ass. Yeah, it's pretty fair, Garrus. Garrus is a good lad. I do like Garrus. Uh, okay, can't get in. Sweet. Alright, another helmet. Pistol High Caliber 3. So, I guess there's a button somewhere that'll help me with that door. Rescheduled, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so they were worried shit was going to go down. Okay. Yay, that one. I can see weapons and stuff in there, so that's the, the bonus. Talon, let's just continue. Data pad, everything sucks. Internal affairs. One die, major, police, nut, executor, stuff. Okay. Okay, we're just getting all the service weapons now. Man, this is the Citadel, guys. Could have left well enough alone. I mean, yeah, we'll head there soon, but... Okay, that's what that did. Right. See, sometimes I just need to move up so that my team moves up and they take out everyone anyway. Let's show them the spike throw off for a little bit. <laughs> 
Stop pulling out the pistol. I had the spike thrower there. That Salarian sure was wiggling his eyes. Oh, the gremlin attached was gone. Yeah, mum. The gremlin's uh, the gremlin's gone and eating his dinner and everything now. So I'm uh, yeah, I'm back to my my regularly scheduled programming. Oh look, an asshole. He's a cute kid. He like. He fucking knows it too, that's the problem. Don't even think about it. Shepard is going to kill us all. That remains to be seen. He said to McCoy he's had enough counselors now to hand over to Cerberus. Takes after his dad. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Hey, buddy. Kirahei. I was Kirahei? Oh, that sucks. I, oh. Now I'm mad at him. Like, don't get me wrong, he was already frustrating me before, but... God damn. Well, try it at least. They've actually got green blood. That's a bit nutty. Yeah, he, uh. We lost another Solarian, but the counselor's okay. My kid, yeah, he, uh, he basically went like two days ago. Like, I want to play Lego, Lego Fortnite. And uh, I don't know, I'd been kind of putting it off a little bit because I, I, I'm not a big fan of those kind of games. So I was like, look, just catch me up that day. I'm going to be home anyway. We'll, we'll do it then. <laughs> he came in this morning and he was just like, when we play this video, I'm going to be a stream. I'm like, oh, sh I guess, kid. We'll see what happens. Dude, I am going to kill you so bad. <laughs> Just keep shooting, Shepard. Hey, oh, it's the booby terminator. Just like Edie. Like, realistically, we should have gone on foot. Also, if you use the uh, if you use the stake thrower, I guarantee you would have killed him. Then. Oh, I love this gun so much. Uh, is there anything over here? Nah. Ah! Oh, I love this gun so much. Oh, got him. Whoop, jumping out of the way. Are you making jokes? 
Bonk. Oh, get back here. There we go. All it took was a stake launcher to the booty. And that took her out. Thanks, Garrus. Hang on, I need to... I just need to check up these stairs. I feel like there might have been something up the stairs. Nope, this was just another way to get there. That's okay. How did they get and how did Cerberus have enough dudes to pull this off though? Like I get I get the whole like oh they've you know infiltrated and stuff but there's a lot of them to be able to give the whole station's worth of CSEC trouble. Data pad. Oh, hello, buddy. Oh, he ate it. I mean, I think I'm shooting it. Oh, man, stop with the smoke! Oh, you're dead anyway. That's what happens when you suck dicks every other recess. Alright, there we go. He deserved every piece of that. Every piece of that was what he deserved. Uh, nope, we're going to check over here for items. Okay. You know, if you just started firing. Okay, I'm in the shaft. Hang on, this will be a fast climb. <laughs> I paused that at the correct time. Get on you, Bailey. I found our friend. Kill his elevator. There's a power conflict beneath it. Lol. Good riddance. Snackle on the peeny ween, bitch ass. Phantoms. I mean phantoms. Oh, hello. I'll just die. Nope, nope, nope. Oh god, okay. Alright, turned her into paste. Picked up Garrus, turned her into paste. Oh, 
Okay. Oof. All right. He looked like he just fell over. Oh, that's right, because Caden wouldn't know about Udina. I'm going to shoot Udina in the face. Pops his head and just, DUDE! Oh, fuck up. Put away the weapon. You don't want this to get up. Trust me, that bastard has it coming. That bastard is one of the last human leaders in Citadel space. Would I do this if I weren't dead certain, Kate? Would I? Odina's behind this attack. The Solarian Counselor confirmed it. Well. Exactly. We don't have time to debate this. We're dead if we stay out here. I'm overriding the lock. <sighs> Shepherd, look at us. This can't end well. Just Dude, if it comes to it, I'm just gonna kill you, Kate, and I don't give a shit about you. I've been waiting to do that since fucking first game. Fuck, I've been waiting to do that for so long. I, I enjoyed that. Oh, I just... Damn straight I did. Damn straight I have. A personal debt and one on behalf of Palava. Yeah, just in general. You don't owe me anything, counselor. Times like this, we all stand together. I should have said just fucking damn straight. Do you have any idea why the elusive man would do this? No, I don't. But I plan to find out. All right, all principles are evacuated. We got a tunnel and a million more places to secure. Move it. Oh, the sky's busted. Yes. Things didn't go as planned. Hey, Donna, how you doing, man? Control of the Citadel and Udina's dead. Udina was expendable. Now what? There are other plans in motion. Dude, how's them drinks going, man? They looked like they were going pretty well. I do have the stake thrower, the bolt thrower. I think it might be a bolt thrower. We looked over every centimeter of those tunnels, Shepard. Your Cerberus pal is made out of smoke and mirrors. He likes to fight. He'll show up again. Pardon me if I'm not reassured by that. We can't even get an ID on him. He released a VI into the Citadel system that erased footage of him wherever he went. Wow, that's pretty money. Come together. I'm not clear on his plan myself. Did he really think he could just take over? More or less. We sifted through evidence from his office and apartment. I'll send you a summary. Right now, I need to monitor some interrogations. Emotions are high, and I don't want anyone getting 
Enthusiastic. Good work today, Shepard. It could have been a lot worse than it was. All right. Oh, Baines. Hmm. No! No! Okay. So I need to check the... Spectre Rick... Uh, thingies. The Spectre thingies. So it says requisitions. That's the word I was trying to think of. Okay. Black Widow. Oh, that's the big one. Reeves. Now, what was that? Not let me. Eh, eh. Oh God. Okay, I guess I can't. Okay, materials, heating stabilizers. All right. Cool. I'll take that out to him at some point. I guess I'll just start at the top, maybe. No, I bought one. I bought one. That that can be it. Sit on through us on Instructors of Grissom Academy requested facilities on the Citadel to train young students to escape the attack on the school. We will not yet ready to join the older students in combat. Citadel authorities will find room for students if a spectre approach. Yeah, why wouldn't I? Of course I want, like, fucking mad lad biotics getting trained. No, I didn't mean to do that. Lettuce leaf. Oh, okay. Yeah, we wanted that sniper rifle. That sniper rifle was nuts. Okay. How did you know that? Keep identity information on all permanent Citadel residents engaged in formal relationships with Asari. Oh, that's kind of creepy. Require diplomatic aid, we can ensure prompt assistance. Yeah, it's a little bit weird. Then you can help me send my daughter back to my wife's family? I'm afraid, however, that might be a bit difficult. All right. That started to suck by the end of that. Do, 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 do. No, there's no one really here to talk to other than come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, that's his name now. You know what, let's go to the fucking Memorial Hospital and say, hey Caden, are you still here, you filthy, stinking, shepherd questioning little bitch. Man, a jail capacity. Hey, how you doing, Imperial? Popping that boo boo out. You know it's getting real when they pop out the ooh. Oh shit, I guess Caden is near. I guess no one's here. Jeez, okay. You uh, managed to palm off those kids yet? Or are you still got the, uh, the neighborhood children just screaming in your backyard? 
Uh, well earned bath, that is fair. You did uh you did deal with children's a lot. What do you mean? They went home round four. Good. Got new equipment. Sent me a set of Vortex armor. Man, summoning and supply shouldn't mess that one up. Oh, I heard those are pretty good. It's great. It'd only be safer inside a tank. That's why Vortex gear costs more than I make in a year. Probably wouldn't say that out loud. You're gonna get rolled. Oh, dude's having a rough night. Uh, where's Joker? It said that Joker was here. Or is he three lower bar? Okay. Hey, Jack! Hey, soldier. Buy a girl a drink? Yes! I didn't expect to find you reading. Duty roster for the students. It's what I do for fun now. They got us spread out across alliance units, reinforcing barriers, modding ammo. You got a lush bathroom from Gelcho because you know you love. Duty rosters while on shore leave. Complain if you like, but I think military life too. Uh oh, that's right. Yeah, because Salem's not a fan of baths. Uniform, don't you? Curves. Come on, plenty of combat, free room and board, and people you can depend on. I love you, Jack. No! You're not getting rid of me that easy. This is a little eye twitch! God, you make the best mistakes. Fucking I do. Shepard, no strings. But if we get out of this alive. Come on. What? What? Oh no, are we about to see Shepard dance? Oh, this is some of the widest shit you're gonna see all day, guys. All day, I guarantee it. Shepherd, everybody knows you can't dance. Correct. He doesn't care. He's gonna fucking... <laughs> He's gonna do whatever that was. <laughs> He's gonna do the little... But now she, see Shepard fucking scared her off with the 80? I'm curious. What material is your base made from? The surface is a flexible biomimetic nanomaterial over a metallic skull. The skin uses shoe thickening technology to help protect the central processing unit in the head. If the skin is struck or shot, it solidifies to absorb the impact. It also is capable of limited self-healing. And what about the hair? It is of similar construction. For defense, I have set it to cohere into a solid piece. That's fair. However, for infiltration purposes, it can be parted into individual strands. If it has recently been exposed to water, I generally can't do a thing with it. So, nah, look. The fact that fucking... That's the limit of my fucking hanging out. No, we should have gone back to the Normandy. We should have fucked the war away and just come up for air later. But no, we went up there, she saw my horrific dance moves, and she left. What up, Joker? Look at this. All it took was a Cerberus attack on the Citadel to get folks around here to pay attention to the war. Now, how is this any different from normal? Can't you see the desperation? This isn't happy dancing. This is forget my problem dancing. Look at the arms. Uh. If a guy waves his arms like that, he's worrying about a lot more than looking 
stupid on the dance floor. That's surprisingly observant. I've had time to watch a lot of dancing from the sidelines. Speaking of which, dancing? Watching from the sidelines. What do you think about me and Edie? Do it. Why not? Because I could break a bone just from some light over the clothes action. Just do it. But then so are the Reapers. Yeah, I wasn't planning on dating Harbinger. Ah! You know what I mean. If we all ended up dead this time tomorrow, what would you regret? Not banging 80. Getting a shattered pelvis and a broken heart. Such a stupid idea. Just go. If you out there right now on the dance floor, would you be waving your arms? Yeah. Sounds like you've got bigger things to worry about than looking stupid. Lol, chucking his own shit back at him. Go and fuck that robot, Joker. Go fuck the robot. What up? It seems the gas <clears throat> can't keep us apart. Since we took back Omega, I've been consolidating my resources for the war. It's a little easier to coordinate from here. It's still weird that you're here. So unfortunately, I'll be slumming it on the Citadel for the time being. I hope this isn't a social visit. We still have work to do around here. Mm. We'll talk later. I'm sure. All right. No one else. All right. Man, I'm just I'm I'm sorry. I'm still a little bit like that was the romantic action that we get thus far. Like don't get me wrong, glad there was more than the initial mooch on a, a fucking ship, but still like come on guys. Uh commons Still looking for fucking heady thrusty things, aren't I? Yeah. Didn't want that. Okay. E gel thermal conduit. There we go. Aquarium VR. Yes. Because now if I get fish in that fucking thing... Oh man, these are all actually... Good. But... <laughs> yeah, I remember... Linux. Come on, guys, give me, give me age of thermal conduit. Yes. I was going to protect. Okay, I'll go and fucking kill him. Realistically, there's no love lost for me with Batarians. That sucks. Oh yeah, shit. Uh, so right down the courtyard, there's a bunch of them. Oh, six. Okay, yeah, so basically go that way. Alright. Oh, shit. Hang on. <clears throat> ah, yeah. Wasn't ready for any of this. There we go. The, uh, the good old redeems for the voices have actually had a pretty good workout the last few days. These are control schematics for Cerberus turrets. Will these help? Hey, how you doing, party? I'll have you crimes dig into them. Might even help us find the little present Cerberus left for us. Thanks a lot. Hope you're, uh, having a good night, party. Just finished the Lego session. 
Did the uh did you manage to stay on the uh the server that I gave you the key for? <laughs> you booty. We're at war. If you care about the safety of the citadel, you'll help CSEC however you can. Thank you, Commander. Dinner time. Man, I just, I don't, I'm sorry, man. I don't think you're fixing it as much as you think you're fixing it. Uh, General Raka. No, I'm working on it. I'm not just going to kill him. I just want to, uh... Picked up a couple games from Countdown Sales, so relaxing while you can. That sounds like a good plan. The, uh, the sales at the moment have actually been pretty good. Realistically, on Steam and elsewhere. Oh, model. But yeah, we, uh, we need models right now. Models and, uh... Probably some fish. Oh, Midnight Suns. I have looked at Midnight Suns a whole bunch of times, but I've never actually picked it up. You'll have to let me know how it is. <clears throat> yeah, you'll have to let me know what uh, Midnight Suns is like. Getting into the guts, correct, Haunter? Getting fucking balls deep in that shit. So heavy into it that, uh... I feel like it's gonna crack any minute now. Minute. Maybe. What do you want? Can I help you? How you doing, Haunter? I mean, yeah, you could probably right tell me... Looks like a collection of access codes. They're Batarian diplomatic codes from back when they had an embassy on the Citadel. If you can use your Spectre access to find them, I can shut them down. I can access restricted intel at the Spectre office in the embassy. If I find anything, I'll let you know. No oh, screenshots. Is my tooth better? No, my, uh, the, the online booking system I couldn't help for my dentist haunter. Uh, apparently went incredibly wrong, and uh, the appointment that I thought I had for today uh, wasn't actually in their system correctly, so I am actually just fucking dying right now. Uh, so, but I did, uh, I did manage to get in there tomorrow, so I just gotta survive tonight, and then, uh, Yeah, so I just got to survive tonight. So I'm just kind of eating painkillers, hoping for the best. Uh, and then, yeah, hopefully tomorrow I'll get to go in there and just say, look, can you fix it or do you need to just rip the fucking thing out? Oh, uh, Haunter, how did you... Uh, I'm I'm interested in how you found Blasphemous, man. Did you uh did you did you uh like it or was it like not quite it? It's awesome. Yeah. What a bunch of civilians shooting at anything that moves. Nice. I'm glad you like it, man. It's a really good game. Uh I really like it. I've been in and out of it like I always tend to like go back to it. Uh, uh, dismiss. There we go. So, so, mostly just serious. <laughs> okay. Um. 
Yes, words. I know words. Yeah, no, I was hoping you were going to like it, Dinah. It's very, um... It's very, uh, uh... 2D, solid, good times. Uh, you were just continuing the process of quality. You are like, oh, please tell me there's voice acting. Like, why is it so good? Yeah, man. It's, um... Yeah, like I said, I, I got it in... A... I got the things. Um, I, words. Yeah, I like every now and then I just kind of go back to it and then I kind of bounce away and then I go back to it and I bounce away and I go back to it. Blasphemous is just a really fucking good game. And apparently number two uh, is also um, like a, a good improvement too. Like, yeah, the first one was there and I was like, I'll send Horn to this one, see if he likes that one. Uh, and yeah, two... Is um focusing on Citadel defense. It won't bring Palavin back, but it's something. And yeah, two is apparently like another good step up. Like so it is apparently very much worth after you run through Blasphemous going in and checking out Blasphemous too. Uh the first guy that throws a big silver cross at you, you're like, oh hell no, nah, this motherfucker's throwing that Masada Nicholas at me, dog! <laughs> oh fuck yeah. No, I remember that. Oh god. It is a good time. I, like I said, I need to go back to it again. I I, I haven't finished it. I haven't finished it. I'd, I'd like to go back to it. So I just need to uh, actually remember to do it. To <laughs> <laughs> Big yawnies. You don't think I'd be yawning since I, you know, basically didn't do jack shit. I just spent the day being in pain. Oh. <sighs> Then play actually no, I'm allowed to be tired. I played fucking Fortnite Lego with my kid. You like it a lot more than, Oh, you like it more than Hollow Knight, nice. That's uh that's fucking that's submission achieved shit there. No, that's awesome. <laughs> oh, no. Now arriving at Docking Bay B20. Eh. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh, it's not gonna give me till I walk out. Oh, there, gimme. I had to go the other side. Uh, Doc's holding area. That's what I wanted to check out. Oh, jeez. Uh, you love High Night, but you fucking hate it because it's like, like Dark Souls are different enough that in a fight you instinctively revert to this bullshit and it does not be working. <laughs> Uh, well, that's, I think the thing is like, yeah, from, from what I've felt, like it's, it's a very good kind of like reenactment of Dark Souls mechanics down to a 2D format for me from what I've, uh, from what I've played. Really, Meat Man? Why are you here, Meat Man? Why is Meat Man down here? I gotta find out why Meat Man's here. Like the most boring motherfucker on my ship is just hanging out, Danny. James, enjoying yourself? Super high quality animation, storytelling, music, and shit. Those clothes are Alliance property. Have a little faith, loco. I have a little. Uh, so that was James. Can I hold C seven? Okay. Nurse, where's this nurse? Is it next one over? Yeah, no, I I don't know what it was about Hollow Knight. Like, Hollow Knight, like I like it, but I haven't. I'll admit that I haven't gone back to it. So yeah. Oh, that's like the stake thrower of. Piercing shit. Okay. Stand strong for your people with Batarian state arms. Do I really need it? All cast restrictions. No. Let's see what the nurse says. Okay. Can I talk to him? Only if it's important, Commander. He's hurt bad. Yeah, I want to talk to him.
Uh huh. Not even what a terrorist is doing on the Citadel. You. Do I know you? <laughs> Every battalion with someone on Aratok remembers your face. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, I did blow up the whole ship. Spent months taking heat for Aratok from both the Alliance and the Batarian. And you know what? If it saved the entire galaxy, I can live with that just fine. Then why don't you? Then why don't you get rid of another Batarian for your precious galaxy? You mean for your precious galaxy? We all fucking live here, dude. No, wait. Oh, this is gonna suck. There. Uh, right. I haven't got any fish. I just remembered that. But I did forget to feed them in Mass Effect 2, and they did die in my tank. So... I am glad I've made sure I got the tank VI, just in case, but... Yep. So the class, documentary maker. Please, maybe you can help. I'm trying to document the stories of the refugees coming to the Citadel. Their loss, their sacrifice, their moments of bravery. Yeah. Holding you back. CSEC won't allow me on the docks. They say I'd be disruptive. Oh, dude. You could catch a few quick shots for me. Yeah, it's fine. The galaxy should see what these refugees have been through. Thank you, Commander. That's exactly what I'm hoping for. If you could just take a few shots with your Omni tool in the refugee camp. I'll be here Take a few shots. Of so, like, yeah, that thing really is like an inbuilt mobile phone for these guys. Um. All right. Let's see if we can't find photos. I mean, it's gonna be. It, I mean, it's XP and money. It's all we're worried about. XP and money. And I guess, like, war effort, you know, resources would be good. But, you know. Resources and money are the big provider because it's war. All right, cool. Wow, he only realistically needed like three. And that wasn't even like the horrendous, like sitting in the fucking, like, you know, the, the fucking campy camp actual bit, so. I have your footage. Thank you, Commander. I'll start editing it right away. How about you edit it up your ass? Oh shit, I need to go to the thing. I needed to go to the embassy. No, no, fuck the docking bay. Fuck 24 dicks. Fuck all the above. I need to go to the Spectre Computron. Out of my way, suckers. Oh shit, okay. Uh, CSEC is five for a civilian militia. Depend on the Citadel. Training, yeah, fuck it. They'd actually be training them. Uh, surveillance. See, there's a number of surveillance officers attempt to find evidence that incriminate service diplomats. Informants in the Citadel. 
Yep. The Terran patient is located in the clinic. Oh, that's just, they're just telling me that he exists. Uh, bypass standard protocols and track top-level diplomatic dispatches the location of consoles access during the suspect ciphers. Will we yep, go. All right, cool. I mean, to be fair, to be fair, I'm kind of giving C-Sex some fucking stupid power, but still. Man, hi. See, that's another game that, like, I need to go back to. Like, I need to go back to Blasphemous. I need to go back to Hollow Knight. Realistically, I need to get back and finish Metal Gear Solid, because, you know, I had to call that earlier than I wanted to. I really wanted to just sit there and power through it, but I was, uh... Feeling a lot like my face was going to fall off, so... Threshold. All right, Valhalla Threshold might be my next stop. What are you on Cortez? Oh yeah, I told him to fucking get off the Normandy, didn't I? Because he was not taking a break. Even with the chaos of all the refugees, seeing so many ships in flight is comforting. Gets me thinking. Hey, a Turian frigate. I think that's the PFS Havenkov. What's one Turian warship doing at the Citadel? Looking for dry dock, I bet. She's seen battle. Look at the waiver in her drive core emissions. Alone, limping, looking for a haven. Maybe it would have been better to just go down fighting, like their families back home. Are you talking about the Turians or yourself? I should have been there. With Robert. Nah. You work. You're alive, and that's a good thing. Him running that survivor's guilt, yo. The Reapers are expecting victory. They won't get it. Nobody is giving up. Not those Turians. Not me. Not you. If anyone can pull this all together, it's you. Is that an Alliance cruiser? What's it doing here? That's the SSV London. Decommissioned years ago. Look. Sorry, I just cut you off because I saw a warship. From a shipyard. Geneva class cruisers always had ESO cores like granite. People find a way to survive. Do whatever it takes to see another day. Just gotta let go. For real this time. The refugees here put up a memorial wall. They leave mementos of lost loved ones. I was thinking maybe... What's stopping you? Nothing. I mean... Let me think about it. Just go and do it, dude. Alright. Renegade points? Okay. Oh, I guess because I cut him off? Um... Oh look, it's the questioning bitch. What's up? I'm trying to wrap my head around what just happened. You sound angry. No, just not used to staring down the gun of someone I've worked with so closely. Yeah, well, you should have listened. It's got me. I don't know. Okay, talk to me. Let's have it. And if it comes to punches, I'm gonna knock you in the shit. I feel like you would have taken me out. I trusted you. All that matters. Ah. The well, that's a non answer. Cerberus is off the Citadel. Yeah, but sometimes the way a thing goes down does matter, Shepard. It's later when you have to live with yourself. Knowing that you acted with integrity, but it matters. You're talking about Adina. He gave me no choice, so I took the shot. Any soldier would have done the same, including you. Yes. Yeah, stop being a bitch, Caden. Jeez. It's another reason I'm here. Hack it off of me in position. But I turn it down in a second if there's a chance to join you in the Normandy again. No. Oh, but then he's going to whinge. 
Oh, what position did he get offered, though? Oh, for fuck's sake. I need more context, Caden. You f whatever. I'm never going to take him anywhere with me. I've already got Liara as a bardic, so... Shepard, I got Anderson patched in. I was just getting him up to speed. Bordina? That SOB was always power hungry. But this? He wasn't in charge. Cerberus was just using him to take control of the Citadel. What the hell for? I don't know. Not yet. Could have been a lot worse. Shepard stopped the assassination attempt on Councilor Valor. What? Your assassin. I'll have Hackett send you my reports on him. I take it you two have met. Haley Sanders and I had our share of run-ins with him. I shot him in both legs once. Thought that might be the end of him. But he should have begun on Omega even stronger. The lucid man patch him up? That'd be my guess. Given what they were able to do with you and Grayson, it's a safe bet Lang's even more dangerous now. I don't care who he is. Next time we meet, he dies. Cause he's a bitch. Their attempts may have had at least one unintended side effect. Right. From the Asari counselor. They're requesting an update on the crucible. I mean, it would be nice if they were helping to start with, but you know. Enough to send help? Yes, the Asari and Solarians are both throwing in their support now. How's your progress on the crucible? Good. Our estimates suggest we've completed nearly 50% of the known work. So quickly? Once decoded, the schematics are designed in such a way that allows our scientists to easily translate the information. Right. Not Protheus specific. That's handy. Are we any closer to understanding how to use it? That's still open for debate. Utilized in the right fashion, our scientists are convinced it can generate enough energy to destroy the Reapers. The question is, how will it dispense the energy? And in what form? You mean... How do you stop it from wiping us all out? Yeah, I was going to say, is that just going to blow us all up? We think the catalyst is the key to determining how to focus its energy, how to direct its energy at the Reapers alone. I'm working on that. You'll find the answer, Shepard. I'll send you an update on the schematics. And in the meantime, we'll keep building. And we'll keep fighting. Make sure there's an Earth left to come back to. Cerberus, Reapers, they'll all pay for this war. One way or another. We're still in this. The gods of war haven't given up on us yet. I mean, Kratos is probably pretty pumped, to be honest. Commander, the Turian fleet is stretched thin. We need more support ships. And the Quarians are willing to talk. Understood, sir. I'll look into it. Be careful. We've got reports of instability along the Geth border. Hack it out. Alright. Shepard, do you... Hey, Liara. What up? Oh, that seems sudden. Something they can't handle? From what I can tell, they sent several commando squads to investigate. None of them returned. They didn't ask me directly, but I think High Command is hoping you might help. Yeah, look, no shit. Everyone's always hoping that I'll help all the time. They ask for help if it wasn't important. The colony's coordinates are on the galaxy map. I'll try to figure out what's going on. Okay. I mean, we're, we're over the minimum. Oh man, the Krogan one's massive, like compared to the rest of them. So, I mean, Alliance has got quite a bit alien. Terminus fleet, rack my work as Citadel. Oh, okay. That, yeah, that includes everyone. Cool. Okay. Already Perseus Veil, Masana Distress Signal. Why do I remember the Perseus Veil? I remember the Perseus Veil as well, but I can't remember what from. New messages? Okay, no. That's valid. I don't know what they were researching, but they were among the elusive man's top scientists. 
they could help build the crucible. Mm. Unless they're indoctrinated, and this was a ruse to get Cerberus close to the crucible. I'm not suggesting we trust them fully, but it could be worth investigating. Has the Alliance tried to make contact with the scientists? They've been unable to find them, but they're searching. As is Cerberus. I've been monitoring Cerberus communications. Mm, don't you call it? Various Cerberus cells by location and cross reference known shipment routes. You found them? I believe so. Yes. Nice work. Put it on the map and I'll give it a look. It's on the map now, Commander. <laughs> Put it on the map. Uh, it's already on there. Commander. You should probably actually look at it. Okay. Uh, Kyling's dossier. Oh, hang on. Game night. I mean, since then, the speak to civilian. I'd love to see our commander should be cool time. Some missions. Why don't you give me a call if you like to grab drinks in your cabin? I promise a night of fun and games. What? She's like right there. Diane Owls. Networks, wall to wall, attack on the Citadel, Udina, Councillor. Yeah, all right. Jack. Oh, hey, this is actually a thing of Jack. You know, should look at this. Well, I did talk to Jack. Ambush the touring cruiser. Location top secret. Right, we got to go invest Corlac. There's Vega. What do we have? Uh, patrol and recon. Patrol and recon. Reprimanded for taking medals from dead enemy officers. I mean, valid, I guess. Raid of... Intion. Okay. So he basically got a whole heap of training in the Alliance and then, and then went off to murder things to the Citadel. Ordering in the Normandy into drive. She's seen a lot of action. Like Small army text. Take her details once she arrives to get your crowd there. You're on short leave. That's an order. Okay. Uh, don't like that. Okay, we got a bunch of missions up now. What's that one? Find the ex-service scientists. Investigate the Asari colony. Speak with the Quarians. Ah, oh, fuck it. You know, we, we're already there. We're already at the Citadel. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Actually, before I say fuck it, let's um, real quickly BRB. I just got to grab myself a drink, guys, and I'll be right back. Right back. Would have tried a Taco Bell, wouldn't you, Tuppence? See, I actually think I remember going to try it when I was on a family holiday. And I was like, hey, I'm... Did anyone fucking see that? Because cause that's just a theory. A Nork's theory. <laughs> If you say it's just a theory, it just gives you a chance to say dumb shit. Oh, right up just an MMO. So also that arm looks really fucking cool. I like it. I like it. Ah, woo, ah. <laughs> it was me. I was you, <laughs> god a damn. Funny it. joke. <laughs> <laughs> funny uh, joke. You, you have absolutely. fallen for my trick. Of course, I want the honors. Let's go. And many kablooey. Oh, rainbow. Oh, I did the thing. I did the thing. You got him? No. Um. No, I didn't. I didn't get him. Do you want to know what I did get? What? Disconnected. Oh no. no. Oh shit. <laughs> well. Well that happened. Okay. Neat. 80 pounds net. English Imperial. Colon? That's a lot of colons. I'm 
real warm. My eyes are just sweating, I promise. Or hurt them. They're gonna hurt the fuck out of them. They're gonna eat shit. <laughs> Can I like hit it from there? Can I hit it from behind? Can I hit it from behind? Ah, oh, we're back. We're back. It'll be good. We're back. I got a drink. I got a drink. Uh, personal apartment. Why not? Oh, yeah. How's everyone's night going? How's how is everything actually going? How I don't think I actually asked Haunter. I, I I was too busy trying to stay in Kermit voice and wanted to um wanted to ask if you tried out Blasphemous. How's your uh, how's your day been, man? Somewhere to bring Jack back to. the entire season your favorite anime to finish so you watch could watch it all and did that and the errands today so now you have food and water nice nice what was the uh what was the anime man what were you waiting for the the whole season of so i tend to do that too i tend to do that with a lot of things just yeah wait for the wait for the whole thing because then that way i'm not just being frustrated as shit uh, you're at work and have a million Amazon tabs currently open discussing the average... <laughs> what the fuck? That seems real sudden, Ceylon. All of that seems real fucking out of the blue. Where's the fucking message? Is it like, do I go behind here? I guess I do. Dinner and sushi place. I've got a th few things you want to go over with you with Norman Ninja Arc. I figure we can meet at that Ryuzi sushi place down the woods here. It's best. Okay. Oh, Spy vs. Family. Nice. I remember you spiked Spy X Family, I guess. Not versed. I, um. Oh, we're going to watch this. That's right. I remember you mentioning that. It looked really good. Oh, it's Al Jelani. She's an asshole. Was the, uh, how was the season waiting for it? Was it good? Okay, I thought there was going to be video along with that. I'm not. I'm not worried about it. This is a nice apartment. Like, I don't think I'd. I mean, I wouldn't turn it down. Having kids would be a fucking nightmare, but still. That show is the greatest thing you've ever seen. Nice. Okay, I might have to actually get around a chair. Who just has those chairs? Who has gamer chair nine thousands as their fucking? Just reclining lounge chairs. <laughs> I mean, whatever, Anderson. It's not like you hang out at home much. Yeah, I'm not listening to that. It's okay. It's okay, buddy. Man, that's right. Keith David's voice. That's making me want to play Saints Row 2 again. 
Actually, Saints Row 1, to be fair. But that's landlocked for the Xbox 360, so... See, Dinah had the same reaction as me of just like, what? <laughs> oh man, maybe I should have turned... You know what? Hang on. I'm going to run back downstairs and turn that music on because this is... Oh, there we go. Okay. So you know how there's like those Rorschach things that certain people see what they want to see and other people don't in that abstract? So what I just saw then when I ran the corner and saw that, that big painting there was not like whatever that pylon is in the middle and the shit around it. I saw like this being like legs with an ass and that being a head leaning in for a smooch. So let's not stick on that path anymore. Bed, man, there's some weird placement for a few beds. Although that's nice. Look at that. Look at that. I better be allowed to bring Jack back here. I'm going to be real mad if I don't get to. I mean, to be fair, I should probably just prepare to be real mad, so. See, there's like another bathroom and stuff, and like... Oh, that's the butt kissing one, just up the other way. You see another bed? There's just like so many fucking beds here. All right, we good. We good. I think we. I think we've seen. Unless I can cook something or start having drinks. Sorry, I just want to climb. <laughs> you, you fucking confused us all, Ceylon, and then went radio silent. Man, I do like this. Oh, maybe I'll play Cyberpunk next, guys. I want to play Dragon Age, but maybe... Maybe... Oh, I'm just looking at this stuff and my brain's going like, yeah, you want to play Cyberpunk, don't you? <sighs> what do you want? No, it just seemed real random, Salon, that that was how that went. Not actually under your company, but we have overnight site rules. Ugh. It's what the wow, I'm going here by myself. I can't decide if that's a power move or that's depressing. Oh, Joker. Oh, yeah, Joker. Man, can you... Okay. Can you imagine, like, Joker making that reservation, just being like, eh, eh, I'm going... I'm going to fucking... I'm going to fucking sushi and I just want a table. Oh, yeah, by the way, it's going to be me and, uh... Commander Shepard. If you're a good boy. Oh, who the fuck is that? But here I am, drink in hand. Best pilot in the universe and a rock star. Ha! Ah! Don't know about that, bud. Any news from the Normandy? Oh, you know, maintenance stuff. Hard knowing a bunch of strangers are poking around in my ship. I, I mean, yeah, shit. So the problem with this is too. Not sure about those shifty aerospace engineers. Always stealing the silverware. Yeah, like fucking we've got we've literally just had the Citadel have to recover 
from getting fucked by spies and insiders busting shit up. And now we are here letting them poke around the fucking ship. This is a shit plan. Nox Nox, one of Restorer just revealed he's not watched Black Lagoon. Oh, he hasn't watched Black Lagoon? Do you mean, are you saying Black Lagoon or do you mean Blue Lagoon? Your email said it was important. My email. I mean, either way, it's the whole thing. The hell? I didn't send anything. Oh. Excuse me. Sorry. Nine's business. Commander, this is urgent. I don't think that's the umbrella lady. <laughs> Commander Shepard, I'm staff analyst Maya Brooks. Alone you haven't watched many anime, I only saw Cowboy Bebop last year. <laughs> There's always people trying to kill me. You got to be more specific than that. Yeah, I think he's aware of that. No, I don't mean servers and the Reapers. I mean other people, new people. There, it's someone is hacking your account. Com channels, personal. Uh, and yeah, so not. Targeting you specifically. Uh, Cowboy Bebop is amazing. I do love Cowboy Bebop. Ha <laughs> you joker. Oh! Bebop, Love is War, and Spy X Family, your favorite just seen so far. Connoisseur is funny but trashy. Uh, look, I know it gets a lot of shit, man, but watch High School of the Dead. I really, really unironically enjoy High School of the Dead. And, uh,. Uh, High School DxD is really good too. It's really funny. Uh, I'm trying to think of like ones that probably not everyone's told you about. I mean, Samurai Champloo. Champloo is really, really fucking good too. That's like a effectively a music based samurai story. Oh, fucked him! I did use you as bait. And this is a hell of a pistol, actually. Shit. Don't watch the live action. Yeah, don't watch the live action Bebop. That's it's not a good plan. Oh, she got fucking owned. God damn it. I don't remember this at all, by the way, guys. This might have been some kind of DLC that I didn't get. Oh, that would have fucking hurt so much. Look at what he's wearing. Oh, bounce. D dude. Oh, fuck. His arm is out now. It has to be. Jeez. He is not having a good time. <laughs> Like, he is fucked now. He has got, like, legions everywhere. His fucking arm has to be out of place. That would have taken some ribs and given him a solid concussion, that fucking landing. But I've got this sick pistol now. Ah, uh, but yeah, like I said, High School of the, high school of the Dead. Are you okay down there? Oh, yeah, Brooks is okay. Oh, he does only have, like, one health pip, so... I kind of hope Brooks ends up on my... on my... Anything? Normandy. Uh, but yeah. I'll high School Dead and High School DxD are hilarious. Um... Oh, hang on. No, I gotta... I got it. There's like this real specific harem anime that I love. There is just... There we are. Hang on. Check. Fucking... It is fucking hilarious. I won't tell you about... 
uh, the crux of it. Just I, w- I just want to make sure that's there so that you can see it and remember the name. Hey, Kane, how you doing, man? How is how is your day so far? I know it's I can't remember what to, it's pretty early in the morning for you, right? So your day probably hasn't really started. Oh jeez. It's really good. Nice. Eleven AM. Okay, so not like super early. I thought it was earlier. Oh, I don't have any Medigel. That sucks. Get a shuttle over there. I'll find a way across. Okay, right. Uh, oh, you woke up at six. Yeesh. Wake up at six is not a great time. Kale here. Kale's here somewhere. Keep at it, bro. Oh, also, stay off your comm. Well, except for me. It's hacked. That's probably how they found you. Who are these guys? I don't know. They really don't seem to like you. <laughs> yeah, I'm sensing that. Sounds about shit crazy. It's so good. It is actually so good, man. That anime is brilliant. I, I, it did that thing that a lot of anime like that does, where it starts off. And it's a little bit ha ha kooky. Oh, this is dumb, and oh, this is just you know, an excuse for like a weird harem anime. But then by the end of it, the story is so good, and the character development stuff is brilliant. So yeah, is this a zombie or like ah uh, koriwa des something in Japanese? Yeah, it's 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 a good time. Okay. So I mean, yeah, I didn't think it was going to do much. Oh, that's a lot of grenades. Okay, so this, this pistol is hitting like an actual gun, which is not, you know, not the first time that's happened in this game, obviously, but this, like, really feels good. I see you, you invisible bitch. There you go. Oh no. Uh, oh, I guess. Oh, I mean, I guess I've got. Explosives. Uh, your friend loves Emmy. Has played the game through at least three times. She gifted me the Legendary Edition for Christmas. Nice, nice. Now she's looking forward to me playing it so she can discuss the game with you. Paper Cut, it is a really good game. Fully recommend jumping on it if you can. Uh, yeah, like I said, if you got it for Christmas, go for it, man. It's... I love these games. I played these games when they first came out. Uh... Yeah, I played these games initially when they came out, uh, back in the day, and the, uh, the Legendary Edition is definitely, Legendary Edition is, oh, you don't like it at all, yeah, 10 hours in, you're not a fan, but yeah, the Legendary Edition is definitely pretty good for it, it's so slow, the combat's clunky, you know, well, if you started at number one, the combat is definitely the worst in number one. Uh, number one, it came in like back when they back when this was the first time they'd done a uh, 
quote unquote RPG from this particular standpoint, especially in uh, sci fi. So I know that they had a lot of trouble back in the first game uh, getting it to move up. But then it got a lot better in two, and yeah, it feels great in three. So yeah, I'd recommend sticking with it, man, just to, just to experience the rest of the game. Ninety percent of the game is try to find the spot you were supposed to. <laughs> no, see, I, I see that's the thing. Like, I didn't really have that much of an issue because, uh, I don't know. Like, I kind of knew where I was going. I, I, yeah, followed the followed the dots pretty easily. Um, but then that also me saying that, I think, um, in saying that, obviously, this wasn't the first time I played it, so. There was a lot of background knowledge there for me when I was going back to it this time. Oh, jeez, bullets. It's all under control. Get down. I'm detecting multiple alarms across the board. What's the situation? Come on. Just last one here. Ah! Headshot. Uh off topic thing you found, you will book the summary. She's a grumpy goth pole dancer, and he's a cocky business pro, and they're paired on a work project. Either sparks or insults will fly. That actually sounds kind of hilarious, Salem. Uh, last 9% is go back and fetch your teammate. I haven't had to worry about that. Last 1% is skipping a lot of the dance. <laughs> no, see, that's the thing. Like, I got right into it. I There's characters in this that I really fucking love. So I... um. We'll admit the talking doesn't really phase me, but I'm also the kind of guy that can sit there and play through an RPG for like, yeah, hours and hours and hours. I can't work out if these guys are like shit to you or if this is a really good gun. Which is now that your friend's going to be disappointed. I mean, like I said, I I would say, man. Uh, like I said, the number one, if your if your main thing is that you don't like the combat, uh, if your main thing is that you don't like the combat, just make sure that you remember that the the systems improved vastly as you get into two and three. Uh, they got way better over time. You can kind of tell that the first one. Uh, was them, uh, the first one was them, uh, obviously working shit out. Uh, but then there was, yeah, like I said, such a massive overhaul in two and three that I would recommend at least just, you know, trying to blast through it to get to the two and three. Uh, especially if you can get yourself into the characters. Like I, I said, I, one of the things that saved ME1 for me really well was that uh you know i really got into the characters so that was super helpful because i could just like yeah i just treated it like an rpg it's really not a shooter when it comes down to it especially not the first one two and three i'm willing to say are shooters with rpg mechanics uh but number one is rpg with shooter mechanics so yeah they definitely lean a lot more into making everything a lot more run a lot more smoothly in two and three so if you think you can get if you think you can get through that like 30 odd hours well i think what i think i i did it on stream in about oh 24 i think it was 24 and i was doing a lot of the side missions so it's been two hours stuck on a planet you can't fuck the ship and the door didn't open because one enemy's still alive somewhere in the mountains oh was that on uh noveria I, yeah, I don't think I ever had that happen. Fuck. Number two has the best husbandos and wife. Oh yeah, number two by far has the best husbandy wife, the husbands and husbandos and wifeus for sure. Like, don't be wrong, I love Rex, but ah, uh, yeah, number two gave me Jack, and I and I'm eternally grateful for that. You're on that planet, you Lucy. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What do you 
mean you like my outfit? This is the same thing I wear on, like, the fucking ship on a daily basis, Liara. Uh, but yeah, like I said, it's just, if you, if you're worried about the game mechanics more than anything, just like I said, if you can push through it, just keep in mind that number two and number three are leaps and bounds better than number one. Leaps and bounds. So that was, to be honest, the combat was like, like I said, I, I was... Not super like, yeah, this is a combat game for me. So, yeah. I'm worried about keeping your will to live. <laughs> I get that. I've sat through some fucking horrendous games. Or games that I've thought were fucking horrendous anyway, so. Oh, well, yeah, 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 Dragon Quest was, Dragon Quest XI was rough. That was getting real touch and go towards the end there, and then I didn't even finish that, I just called it a fucking day. Uh, if it hadn't been gifted you by a dear friend, you would have uninstalled it. <laughs> uh, uh, like I said, I got, yeah, like I said, my, my, my... That's the thing, though, is that I do genuinely enjoy these games. Like, I I got real into Mass Effect. I got real into the lore of it and how the world's worked and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, I... I... I would say to persevere and see if you actually... and see if you start connecting with some of the characters some more. Hey, buddy! What are you doing here, Rex? Everyone loves it too, it's clearly a good game for... Yeah, like I said, I just... Yeah, it was it was the right game for me. I think a lot of people like... Uh, like I said, ME1 especially too. Uh, ME2 and 3 go into it expecting some action. Uh, but ME1 is just so much more a kind of like slower RPG. Hey, thanks, buddy. Ooh, that looks like a hefty gun. It was spinning barrel, so I don't know how to take that. Oh, it's a heavy. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I don't remember how much I'm going to deal with Brooks after this. Actually, like I said, I can't remember any of this, so... You wouldn't use the word slow, you would describe tech time fights. <laughs> oh, that poor bastard. I just remembered that he's like that manager for this thing's just sitting in there. Man, I'm about to have a shield. All right, we're good. Uh, a lot more talking than what Tectonic plays. So yeah, we got because like me, me going to Mass Effect, the last Bioware game that I played before Mass Effect, uh, that was an RPG, was Baldur's Gate Two. Uh, so yeah, like I said, I went in there just expecting, I went in there expecting dialogue, uh, like lots of conversation side quests or that kind of shenanigan. 
so yeah, for me that was that was kind of what I walked in expecting. Who were those mercenaries? They were heavily armed and using C sector shuttles. I don't know. I've never seen them before. I can't believe you survived all that. They have guns and grenades and those drone things. It's all right. I'm calling Commander Bailey. See what's going on. Off topic. Okay, that sounds the unfuckable preacher's daughter. Four devastatingly handsome windsurfing champions! <laughs> And the game that changed their lives from- Yeah, what the fuck, Ceylon? What's with the- Why did- <laughs> What the fuck is that? That's real sudden. What do you mean windsurfers showing up to bang a preacher's daughter? And windsurfers are drowning in poon. That's why they always have to leave. That's why they have to leave the bonds of the earth. <laughs> okay, I like Brooks. Uh, yeah, what do you mean windsurfing, Ceylon? why they need you dead, Shepard. Nothing to stop them till the damage is done. Okay. Let's figure out who they are and shut them down. Uh, Ideas? It's the summary. No, I figured it was the summary. I just... The pistol you picked up. Which is a tiny thing. It packs a punch. Never seen anything like it before. <sighs> Let me see if I can do something else. <laughs> oh, no! Well, you can try, but I should warn you. I haven't found anything yet, and I've been digging pretty deep. I'm sure you have. Glyph. Noguchi is still yet to finish Fall of Hyperion. Oh, man. Thanks. All right, the hour's on point. Reminds me, I need to finish Praise. Yeah, what about... <clears throat> Not Praise. Neon Gods. You've been busy. I found some folks who actually like being shot at. Permission to come aboard, Shepard? All right. Speak to squad mates. Okay, later, when this is over and everything is settled, we are going to talk about this bait thing. <laughs> uh, yeah, I did tell him to just run. Normandy's nice, but for unwinding after a mission, you can't get better than this. Uh, back in school, Azra acted the good girl with her conservative clothes and her head always down. Everyone laughed at her, even the four popular brothers. She hated them for it. But high school is over, and when they meet again, a lot of things have changed, including Asra. The brothers hardly recognize her, yet the brothers still love a challenge, and whoever she is, she's perfect for their game. The rules are simple. Their plaything needs to know what she's in for, and needs to agree. Uh. Yeah, I've read the first one. I read the collection in the first one, like the um, Omnibus, that first one. Uh, it's really fucking good. Hyperion's a real good series. Not for you, mate, man. The restaurant attack has made the news. Civilian casualties seem to have been restricted to fish. Hello, Shepard. Alright. Yeah, Hyperion books, like I said, I, I read the first one, that like collection of shorts. I found something. We can gather the team whenever you're ready. Nah, I wanna talk to the rest of the team first. Do 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 do. Oh, come on. A little over halfway through number two, drop the whole ensemble story thing. Yeah, that's that's what I'd heard. Like the the ensemble thing is a good idea to read first, but then you t you move on pretty quick from what they've said. 
Oh, Miranda Lawson. Garris, Liara, Yavi. Hang on. Oh, I need to actually go and talk to him in a minute. But Miranda's got a thing. Oh, whatever. If you see Virgin Redemption and Fake Fiance as a tag again, it will be too so. That's a lot of weird. That's a lot of keywords all, all, all at once. Ceylon. Two us through the eyes of a second Keats clone Cynthia. Oh, okay, that'll be yeah, that could be interesting. Oh man, you can get, you can get. Oh man, I want to decorate my fucking house now. I'm glad you made it out of that ambush. Okay? Sounds like rookie numbers. <laughs> but lesson learned: never have dinner with Joker. It won't end well. Need to scroll through the page. Ooh. Hey, Garris, you and your snippy spot. <laughs> yeah, about that. I mean, we can hope they won't. It's because you banked more than the puppets. Uh, that'll be a lot of effort for a dude that hasn't left the state in a while. Uh, there, there. Oh, Rex. Bet you never saw a shuttle get taken down like that before. Fuck no, I haven't. You're a beast, Rex. Fuck yeah, you do. Commander, in my cycle, when we select combat by falling through tanks containing aquatic animals, we usually... Oh, right. We never did. <laughs> Double ups and tourists. Uh... Is like quantum link with the memory chip thingy of the one that died, so you get to keep up with the gang from number. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I'm glad you get to keep up with them. I was I was wondering how that'd go. Like, yeah, whether you got to hear anything else about them over time. Okay. All right. What are you gonna say, Brooks? He, I mean, he kind of does. He's also being controlled by me, so he's not very good at avoiding getting shot. Would you like me to call the meeting? Do it. Do it. Ugh. I called in some favors to run a trace on the gun. It led me to a casino owner named Elijah Khan. He's been suspected of using his profits to smuggle weapons onto the Citadel. What a bastard. After the attempt on Shepard's life, Khan made an interesting call. There. Uh, so if you're getting hurt, need to double down on shields, not waste time on dodging. Uh, I do have like a lot of health though. No doubt hired by the thief, not by Khan. That phone call was pretty damning stuff. How'd you get it? Magic. The weapons, biometric data, Solarian intelligence, and a Hanar prostitute with camera implants. A Hanar prostitute. No, but the truth is boring. Whoever that voip was, Khan's nervous enough to cut them loose. We can squeeze Khan. Yeah. <laughs> contact drops out. Easier said than done. He has a panic room inside the casino. A good place to hole up. Edie can give us programs to hack the door, but the cameras and guards complicate things. I mean, I can shoot them all. Khan could disappear. <clears throat> or worse, if his guards ever open fire, normal people could get hit. Aren't the Hanar? Yeah, the Hanar are you jellyfish boys. He's right. So if there's a Hanar prostitute out there, 
That's a uh, that's a fairly specific service. Pass. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's kind of where I was going with it. Purchase some tickets, Glyph. Then call up a layout of the building. Don't often, but pass. Yeah, I'd probably not be jumping on it myself. How close can you get? We don't usually put a back door in a panic room. This air shaft bypasses the security gate and ends up in storage. From there, the panic room's door camera can be disabled. Still, we're talking about a casino. There's got to be alarms in that shaft. <laughs> I believe I have some countermeasures that may help. I'll know more once we're inside. Who will go in this shaft? They need to be small in size. Yeah, that's not me. Too many snacks of roast bear and leg. Duh! <laughs> My presence in the casino would arouse suspicion. Mechs are not allowed, since they can have cheating software. What you need is somebody trained in zero emissions tech. No electronics, no metals, just undetectable polymers. We had a course back at Op In. Disabling a bomb would be really tasers. See, the bomb was filled with shaving cream. All right. We are not sinning. Oh, fuck. No. What? Hannah are biologically genderless, though others may assign arbitrary gender values to them for convenience. Despite evolving in water, Hannah also, Hannah also appear to be able to breathe air. Or use technological means to enable this. Also, despite appearances to the contrary, Hannah do have skulls. All right. That's the plan, Chris. Get whatever you need and be ready. I mean, if that's what I mean, they've at least got a skull. They're not. They're not completely everythingless. Black tie required. All right. Black tie required. I mean, you know what? Let's just, yeah. Eels up, in, up inside you. Get the eels up inside you. You ever drunk Bailey's from a shoe? Oh, Liara, that is not the dress. Nah, that's not the dress, Liara. Nah, nah, that's not, I'm not, I'm not into that. Sorry, Liara, you dropped the ball. She looks like... There was a Doctor Who companion. She looks a lot like. Liara, you have any input? Khan has a lot of surveillance set up. I feel like okay, last time I was at Salons, okay, we watched an episode that had her in it. And I Mingle, 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 mingle. And I don't remember her name at all. I can't help but wonder if that's her. Martha, that might be it. If you need a place to stay or anything, you just let me know. I have a place to stay there, but thanks. So you had nothing before that? Oh, how brave of you to endure, dear. I was on the ship. Are so resilient. Like that phrase of theirs, stiff one in the lip. Stiff upper lip. <laughs> I was going to say. Hey. How you doing, Imperial? No, you're not Imperial. Fuck, I am just so used to that at the moment. How you doing, no camping? No killers this time? Nah, not now. Not now. We moved on from that. We, uh... We had the, uh, the Fortnite Lego scenario, and that got finished up. Enjoy how you have literally negative 5,000 patients. <laughs> no, look, it's kind of one of those things where, like, you get to the point where, like, you guys get to see it. You you guys get to see, little man breeze like me. See, you guys get to see, right, when Logan turns up, okay? 
when when like Logan turns up on camera and he's there. But what you haven't witnessed is the previous eight hours where all I've wanted to do was just like say, please, child, I want to shake you like a baby because you just refuse to not be an asshole. So. So yeah, you guys, yeah, you guys get to see the, uh, yeah, when you guys see me hanging out with my kid on a stream, uh, yeah, like I said, that's, that's usually the tail end of the nightmare. Uh, what are you doing? El no, nah, I don't like your name, Elspeth. That's, that's a bit of an odd name. Varen Racing? Nah. We're not Varen Racing. Evening, officer. Ah. Alright, I guess I'll go and talk to Elspeth. Elspeth. Or go to the bar? What, what up, buddy? Nothing too crazy. I want to be You're on reading duty for like six hours of Tim Tim on Cr- Oh, yeah! Oh, jeez! Mindfish. I guess since they're mostly water, the dehydration would be bad. Right. So there's this fish with hallucinogenic skin oil. Hallucinogenic skin oil. What happens if humans eat it? Way more potent, and it releases into our system slowly. It's best to clear your schedule for the entire weekend. I mean, that sounds like a good time. If we're gonna be fair. <laughs> that was funny. Shit. Man, I yeah no I uh all I can think of is just. Yeah, having to go on reading duty for that would be unfortunate. They were co-ops, so you only had to read everything once. Good. Who hasn't? That's why I'm running. I got sick of leaders with ties to Terra Firma or Cerberus or worse. Oh? The ward needs refugee facilities. It needs security. It needs jobs. It needs everything. I mean, yeah. And hopefully with a friend like Eliza... Sign me up for Mindfish. Yeah, trust me. I'm like, I'm hearing about that. I'm pretty keen. Yeah. Like you can't imagine. Well, not again. Bring on over this side, there he is. What? There's a guard right below me. Don't panic. I'll get his attention. Uh, where is this? Over there. What up, buddy? Excuse me. I think I saw someone doing drugs in the men's room. I see. Were you able to identify the substance used? Red sand. Dispatch, we've got a sand tripper in the bathrooms. Have they tried to compromise the games biotically? Unknown at this time. Moving to confront. Send backup. We're taking care of it, sir. Appreciate the help. So have a good night now. You're clear, bro. Give me that icky, sticky, oily MDMA salmon. Fuck you. Yeah. Slow and steady. You'll get to come. Like I said, the uh, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Mindfish sounds pretty good. the party so far there's a party Zeos. i feel like i should know that yep i did a little acting then in the 70s during the blitz i was named goodwill ambassador for refugees so i guess this kind of thing doesn't really impress you 
Me? No. With the people who can get clothes because you bought a ticket? Much different story. Israel's it's getting late, and you have a full schedule ahead. Don't handle me, Noah. If I reach one more person before we leave, that's a family of four who can eat tomorrow. I mean, she's kind of there for the right shit. Isn't the only help to give. If you drop some credits at the games, it goes straight to refugees. You missed the first volley. Your whole day was kind of foggy. Blissfully so, even for this. And I presume you mean on the inside. Oh, jeez. Alright, let's go. Select one of the four baron to place your bet. If wins the base, yep, lower the chance, yep, okay. Uh Nice beans. Let's go. Let's go. C sec biscuit. Five hundred. Beans. Because the tiny screen is a sleeping duck. Which one's been? No, okay. Nice beans one. Man, I love that that's actually voice acted. Uh, let's go. Wait, tuna fish dog? Those are awfully old Earth references, correct? Let, no, let's go optimistically, we'll win. No, optimistically, we'll win. He's not going to win. Now we're going to go tuna fish dog. Oh, give me a better camera angle, guys. Come on. Hey, there we go. Tuna fish dog, FT dubs. Oh, to chunk and to ch I've got a I've got a fucking I've got to chuck a bet on to chunk and princess before I go. Fuck yeah, to chunk and princess. We we out. We out. Get away. Talk to me, Brooks. I've got a pressure pad and an obstruction detector ahead. I can't disable them from here. Okay. Edie, I need a tech solution. Brooks, stay put. We'll find some junctions and take down the sensors. Okay. I'm at I a junction. Him There's a camera and a guard. I'll just be here. I'll draw hit buttons. We'll be in cloud upstairs. Just a second, ma'am. I'll contact the surveillance desk. The camera saw me. Ah. Oh. Fuck. Okay, weekly. I bring greetings from the consulate Shaira. She instructed me to schedule a session with you free of charge. That's very kind, miss. But we have to clear all our Brooks, try it now. Checking the pressure pad. No alarms. Looks good. Okay. Uh, I mean, there's a lot of red wiring. They have 
There we go. We're good. Yeah, because no one's going to notice the, the fucking scary golden eyes. Shit. Ah, this dude just running laps this fucking hole has to be kind of weird. Hey. Just calm down. I'm trying to do three different things here. Harold? Sir, I checked out the alarm in storage. It's nothing. Minor accident. Find out who tripped it and get them in my office by end of shift. And if they're not there, I'm gonna fuck you in the ass! What? Care to elaborate? Most people in this casino are here for a good cause. Others are just here to be seen. Oh. Edie Goat. Edie is always good. Edie's one of the best members that we've seen. Others who are not myself need them. So the honorable thing to do is part them from this money. So you're a con man. Con men leave their marks angry. Con artists. Edie built different. Edie built correctly, which is different as far as this place is concerned. What up? The Larian parties is they all do it too well. I don't fall. Very correct. My lab group on Turkesh. All Solarians but me, and all with damn near perfect memories. Oh, that could get awkward. Yep. Exactly. It was all about who burnt the cake six months ago or arguments that two people continue when they meet up once a year. So that uh, sounds gross. Yeah, it was constant one upmanship. I couldn't keep pace with them if I wanted to. So you don't miss Sarkesh at all? Not the humidity and not the lack of privacy. The science was. <laughs> hey. Thank you for the gifted sub anonymous. Way more than I wanted to know. Hey again. Back for more tales out of school? Sure. <laughs> oh no, dying! Solarians came up with satellites that eat orbiting debris. So their space isn't all cluttered like ours. I mean that'd be handy. What won't they think of next? Hair extensions. Hair extensions on a Solarian could be funny, though. Okay, so now I think you just need to get to me. I'm on the other side of the security gate. Right. Have you bypassed the camera back there? Well, I got my side. Yours is still on. I can't get the security gate to open from here. The junction must be on your side. It might be tricky, just so you know. Have a little faith. I can distract him. Tell me when. Hey, thank you, Anonymous, for the five gifts on that one. That's awesome. So, Jack Legs, DJ, Samurai, and Life all get... All get sweet kitty cat emotes. I just got done returning donations from some terminus pirate woman. Was her name Arya? Ha! Ah! Oops, can't see me with the fucking heart train. But yeah, let's uh yeah, let's hear it for anonymous with all the all the gifted subs. Mm. Good job. Good job. Always welcome. Every gifted sub is another gifted chub. We'll go with that. Those cufflinks. 
Is that design inspired by late period in Rasanan artwork? The attention to detail is remarkable. Fuck! My floor. A guard spotted me. If you act normal, hopefully he'll I need to stop getting caught. Gifted chub, I did, I did, Dinah, I did. Should I point out the flaw in that statement? Oh, are you like one of those detail people? Come on, <sighs> even diamonds have flaws, but that doesn't make them less valuable. Miss, where exactly were you educated? Oh, okay. Ox offering doodles as you Oh, that's right. Only chub. Uh Man, I oh, I had all intentions of starting that, but I just did not get anywhere near it. Uh, is there somewhere I can go to make a private call? Liara, why are you putting on that accent? Let me see what I can do. Now I'll look away. Lara, why aren't you putting it on more often? I will admit, that'd be, yeah. I'd kind of almost enjoy it if she did. Con, you and me are gonna have a talk. Or I'm gonna shoot you in the back of the head. Unless, of course, you're already dead. My eyes are still kind of gold. What the hell? I see this conversation will be dead. quickly one-sided. Commander, there's a deletion order on the terminal. Everything's in white. I don't know if it was him or the killer or... Oh, when I trip that alarm, did I screw this up? What are you looking for? Mistakes. Realistically, we probably want Edie to sort that. Whoever it was had to do this fast. They wiped the terminal, but not the comm. Oh, so we can take the comm back to the safe house to scan it, or... Oh, I should have come crawling back. Guess again. Jill, I see you've recovered from flopping on the floor like... Name a time and a place. Or you could hide behind voice disguises for the rest of your life. You're trying to rattle me so I slip up. You have nothing. All you can do is wait for the hammer to fall. Bring a bigger hammer. Your last try was inadequate. I'm gonna take everything <laughs> you have and everything you are. Damn it. Sorry, Commander. There wasn't enough time to trace the call. We're not finished. Pull out the... <laughs> Mm. Yeah, probably. The sooner we get them to her, the sooner we can track down this threat. Small peepee -pee joke. Small peepee -pee joke. Thank you, Shepard. That was fun. Well, not so much for the host. It wasn't a total loss. Brooks, work with Edie to see if there's anything useful on those drives. Here's hoping. I'll let you know what we find, Commander. Oh, jeez. Alright. Damn, Commander. You can't even attend a party without someone ending up dead. That's because I'm a cool guy. Just find some chow around here. you think a pad like this would be stocked. Hey, this is fucking my apartment now. Don't go fucking giving me shit. You run my casino run in with the Vulture Mafia, 5,000 credits and a bottle of whiskey? Actually, never mind. Fuck you, Caden. That didn't happen. Much like every dude that ever says he fucks so good that a prostitute gave him his money back. That didn't fucking happen. A glamorous mission, but not our most successful. At least we didn't come away empty handed. <laughs> Kale knows what I'm talking about. Just in general. Me too, buddy. It had to happen once, sir. Right? <sighs> nah. Minimal belief on that one. Big yardies. Yeah, no. I think we've got something, Commander. Good. I am glad to see my physical proximity was not necessary. 
celebrate the success of the mission shepherd. Let's see what Commander. You've never had a customer with such an amazing customer. I pay them for stock. Yeah, that's it. Like, that's one of the things where I'm like, it's literally their livelihood. They're not just handing that back because you had 30 seconds of good pump. Edie has an incredible talent for stock. I know she's an AI, but even still, we found an encrypted communication from a few days ago. Just need another minute to crack it. A whole minute? Edie here could shave that down to five seconds. I thought it best to allow staff analyst Brooks a chance to improve her decryption skills. And now you've lost your chance to show off. Like she needs it. You're the crew of the Normandy. You're legends to the rest of the Alliance. <laughs> legends can be good or bad. Which are we? You're the kind that people look up to. The kind they You're all having 30 seconds of good pump. <laughs> oh, jeez. Rex. I thought I kind of succeeded in a right over the Krogan's head sort of way. And the camaraderie, the friendship. I think that's your secret weapon. Oh, shit. It's all just part of the job. Wait. Job? You mean the rest of you are getting paid for this? No. Here we go. Oh, uh, this is called charity murders. Those marks who were after you, they bought a lot. Who's giving out a whole 30 seconds? <laughs> a whole 30 seconds? Punch it up. The archives are going into emergency lockdown. Whoever's hacking your records is there right now. What do we know about the place? Some cross someone need to be court martialed for the design of Edie. Oh man. Josh, Edie's design is real specific, isn't it? Then we'll find our own way in. Gear up and let What the fuck? What's with the vault? <laughs> I got the munchies. Fuck you, mate, man. Who says we can't? All hands on deck for this one. Hell yeah. Even you, meat man. Who gets to take point with you? <laughs> <laughs> Why are they all coughing at me? Who's going to pay the bill? When you make Cortana look like a two, someone has questions to answer. <laughs> oh, I'm taking Edie with me. I kind of have to take Edie with me. And Rex. Hang on. No. Because. Yes. Fuck it. Edie and Rex. Oh. Oh shit. I don't have a weapon load out. Because. Fucking video game. No, not them. I want my fucking spike thrower. That's the one. Uh, is it that one? Yep, yeah, that's the Solarian gun. Uh... Spike thrower. Ow! Oh, shit! I didn't check the other guns. Whatevs. The facility is located below the board. Maybe a direct breach for maximum surprise? I like it. Sounds like you're learning the ropes. Hell, hang out with us long enough and you'll learn ropes, knives, bombs, thresher mods. Oh, that's just a good night in, Cortez. Oh, she went and got some combat armor on. Nice. Not really. <laughs> Pretty tricky to get in there. Have you seen C4? Says Meat Man. See you at the party, princesses. <sighs> Ooh. 
But yeah, I do kind of feel like uh, someone at Bioware on the design team was just sitting there like adding details to Edie's body for a long time. Way longer than expected. So, like, have these guys considered what happens if I kill them all over and over again? Wait a minute. Why does that dude look like me? That's weird. Looks like I'm shooting him. <coughs> I got some fucking tanky armor. Who are you? You weren't the only shepherd that Cerberus brought back to life. But at least one of us will finally do something with it. Oh. Where did you come from? The same DNA as you. A clone. Cerberus spared no expense in resurrecting you. With me, I was created for spare parts, in case you needed another arm, or a heart, or a lung. Where have you been this whole time? In a coma, until I woke up six months ago. While you were in a jail cell on Earth, I was learning to be you. Right. Amazing what a person can do with enough neural implants. If you're really me, then we're on the same team. We're not even in the same league. Did the elusive man send you? No. He abandoned me when he had what he wanted. You. Then why did you make him think to kill us? Because I don't have his memory. I'd never fool my supposed friends. Mm -hmm. The ones who abandoned their duty to join the cult of shepherds. Like you, Edie. You're nothing more than electrons pretending to be alive. And you are just a pale imitation of the real thing. I'm the real thing perfected. But, you like... Tear, Shepard. The doubts, the failures. I'm the lone wolf you were always meant to be. How does that... Without the emotional baggage holding me back. No one will ever believe you're Shepard. They will when I'm flying a ship. Fucking Cerberus. Shepard, initiate Normandy lockdown. Transmitting command codes now. Good idea. Too bad the signal was blocked. Trainer, this is Shepard. Prep to Normandy for emergency departure. We're leaving. I'm setting the command codes now. Acknowledged. We'll get underway. I'm gonna kill you. I I'd say it, but I'm looking forward to killing myself. Your spare parts. Yeah, that's it. Violence when in our DNA. But mine is more than a threat. Execute them. The cult of Shepard ends today. Hefty bonk. We still got everyone. Dude, just... Ha! Fucking hell he did! He just obliterated that motherfucker! I love that Rex is working on catchphrases. Oh, he's such a fucking cool guy. I love him.
<laughs> I like that. They've got a Krogan. Why don't we have a Krogan? Oh, you got fucked! Where did the other shepherd go? He's pushing into the archives. Stay in your group. Shotgun ultra light materials, nice. Don't start that in fight. That was a debate within the general community for so long. But I think we end up with a hammerhead fucking in Andromeda, don't we? The, uh, the like, the car to roll around with in, instead of, like, the fucking hover thing. Also, I'm not doing Andromeda. Like, not, not straight away. I'm, uh, after I finish Mass Effect 3, I'm gonna need a break. From, from the mass affecting. I'll, uh, I'll fully admit that. Especially when Andromeda's not good. Like, I don't know. Ne Neon City Daily saying it was good, but... Oh, it just did not get me. It did not keep me in. It was never released. <laughs> well, hey, look, you you tell me. You're my, uh, you're my mod, Kale. You're the one that has the ability to uh, check and retain these things. So I guess if you say it never came out, it never came out. Big place. At this point, Oh, fuck knows. I don't want to talk about it. Perhaps we will resume discussions when everyone has consumed alcohol. I mean, we will. Yes, Commander. Track the target. Give me updates on its location. What is the nature of the target? He looks like me. Then I have found the target. No, Glyph. It's a <laughs> no, Glyph. The other fucking one. Waves hand. There is no. <laughs> there me. Oh. Yeah, Shepherd Prime built different. Yeah. How you doing, Tuppence? The other me. My brand. Oh, fuck him. How you doing, though, Tuppence? As you're not going. God, I love this gun. You are not so well. Oh, yeah, you were saying earlier that you weren't feeling great. Is it a... Like a throaty sick thing? You just want to pop in to support my special little guy? Thanks, Tuppence. Yeah, thank you, Tuppence, for the chillin'. I... Oh, it's a fever. Oh, damn, man. That's, uh... Is searching for something 200 meters ahead. You got meds at home? You 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 able to, like, dose up with some, uh... What is it with fevers? With fevers, it's paracetamol, right? Fucking spare part ass motherfucker I've got to go and find. That's what you've been taking, yeah. Yeah, I have heard a lot of people are like, holy shit, we've got COVID again lately. Not bad enough for a COVID test, it's fair. I will admit, I think that's one thing that like, sticks in my head. Is that, um, yeah, the fact that, ah, like I know COVID puts me down like a motherfucker, does mean that, yeah, unless it's, unless I'm like, you know, fever dream bedridden guy, I kind of know it's not going to be COVID for me. Because, yeah, that, that shit dropped me like fucking a pile of tank treads just being sent down the line onto my brain. Well, you haven't been in contact with anyone who's had it recently. I mean, that's a bonus. 
That is always handy. I, yeah. Those bullets are real slow. Ha! Ha ha ha! Oh no! I pushed the wrong. Hang on. Oh man, I think I missed it. You know what? I got those cutscenes. They weren't shooting, but I got those cutscenes. Gonna lurk and distract yourself with Rogue Trader. Yeah, good good choice, man. Rogue Trader's a good time. I uh I'm really enjoying Rogue Trader. I got I got um uh distracted with uh Hogwarts Legacy, but yeah, Rogue Trader is definitely high on my list of gotta go fast, gotta keep going. Oh, you finished chapter one today, nice. And when we conquer your earth, I look forward to teaching you. Oh, okay. Okay. Now, sorry if I, I just realized too, sorry if I look like I'm having a fucking stroke today when I'm chilling out. Like I just the comfy space that I can sit at for where my, my tooth hurts. Uh other me is looking for in here. Your seven hundred CEs. Hogan rebellions attack the fuck? Vault K three oh six. Oh. This is the only visual record of Krogan Overlord Credic's attack on the council. Audio follows. I've heard enough. If the Krogan hasn't Toughens all of us are fucked up in the club. Yeah, yeah, none of us having a good time, I don't think, right now. No, that's where I came from. No, that's... No? Oh, jeez, he's just shoot. Oh, okay, down there. All right, we're good. I know where I'm going. He popped a friend's stream playing the first one of these last night, and he said, all I know about this game is that I love Rex. <laughs> oh, you're just in time for the sex scene with the blue alien. Yeah, man, I banged Liara in the first game, too, this run around. You, you pretty much get, like, once a game, if you play your cards right, you get the chance to bang one of the, the quote-unquote love interests. Uh, there's no... Oh, shot something. I'm oh, sorry, but the fact that Rex just yelled, now who's the dead one? Sounds like what you were describing. Uh, hey, you've been sick for a while before Christmas and even felt like a flu, but not COVID. It sucked. Oh, yeah, that sounds gross. No, nah, that just sounds real fucking unfortunate, guys. Like, I am glad that I've avoided that. I mean, like I said, I've got, like, an unfortunate... Oh, very, very painful. I feel like my face is falling off tooth scenario, but yeah, I'm not... I'm not catching fevers or anything like that. So yeah, no, that uh, that sounds fucking rough. Especially because it sounds like it hangs around a bit.
Rex just appeared there. Uh, Nibble, did you get Little Bear? I had to go to shave and fight for <laughs> I don't even know if Nibble's here, man. Sorry, I, I, yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, okay, Nibble's streaming, right. Wrong chat. Yeah, thought that might have been, thought that might have been what happened there. There we go. Got him eventually. Commander, I have cataloged 18 previously unknown historical events. Where's the target, Glyph? He is searching for a secret vault. He did not wish to be disturbed. What? I thought he was you. <sighs> go find him again. Stupid machine. <laughs> go find him again, you motherfucker. Click the channel, open up a second Norks. I just thought. You raider. Oh, shit. sorry, man. Popped in because it said Pokemans here moved on to Miku Project Diva. Nice. He is, uh, he is building a good collection of Miku games at the moment. He's, uh, they've all looked pretty good, actually. He's been looking like he's been having a lot of fun with them. Oh, this... Oh. Oh, got in there. I must admit, observing the next explosions is oddly satisfying. <laughs> Edie's getting in on the murder. Man, I do not remember this mission at all, by the way. I remember the other shepherd. But that's about it. It's just ahead. They wish to inflict bodily harm on you. Also, I discovered an Elcor mating totem in Vault 347B. Uncle Erdnord has a present for you. This fucking, whatever this is, this DLC or whatever it was, had some fucking gold Rex lines in it. Oh shit. Uh, what if I chucked another grenade? Alright, I'll just shoot him in the fucking hand then. Or not. God, I love Rex. Oh shit, no, I won't. Ha! <laughs> Rex just fucking ruined his shit! Oh, that's brilliant. I love you, Rex. Yeah, Rex is so good also. Also, like, Haunter, I, I am glad that you... Uh, I am glad that you got into Rex. Rex is a fucking cool guy. Rex is one of the coolest fucking guys this whole series. I do love Rex. Bestest boy with a little bit of competition here and there, but real good boy. Commander, the other you wishes to pass on a message. Shepard, save yourself the trouble. Once I have what I came here for, you won't matter anymore. Now go, drone. Deliver it. Huh.
hmm. What's a hmm, NCD? What's going on, man? Would have been funny if they just used the opposite gender for Shivers Glenn. Oh, that would have been good. Love for Rex. That's because, like I said, Rex is one of the goodest boys you ever did see. Like, I, I always assume it's a red flag if someone doesn't love Rex, to be honest. Uh, would have been funny if they just... Should, I do kind of wish they used the opposite gender for, like, the other one. I, that would have been good. That would have been... I would have wanted to see that, actually. You wouldn't know you keep failing him. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's right. You haven't seen him beyond game one, so yeah. He's up above me. Over there. Rex is like my dog. When someone doesn't like my dog, I don't trust them. But when my dog doesn't like a person, I absolutely trust them. Yeah, exactly. That's how I look at it, man. That's that's where I am on it. Uh Haunter. Team Hammerhead, we're headed to the next level. What's your location? We'll put him in the ground. Hammerhead, do you copy? So here's the question though, is like how much do you backpedal on the Krogans during the third one? Bant. Oh. Oh. There we go. Oh, that's a snippy riffle. Sonic Rings! <laughs> I've never actually seen that! I've never like... <laughs> so I was expecting it to like pop out. I was gonna blast it with a shotgun. It was gonna be a whole thing, but there's fucking Rex just like whoop 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 pushes it behind the bookcase and just fucking hits it so hard that shit flies out of her! Oh fuck! Okay, no, we're good. Okay, we're good. We're good. Just fucking bling! <laughs> oh, jeez, that was funny. Oh, that caught me so fucking hard. I wasn't ready for that. <sighs> okay, no, I'm good. I'm good. I'm focused. I'm focused. I'm good. Team Mako, we're coming up behind. What's your status? Mako, where are you? You're twenty one eighty three. Oh, you shit, Lord. Alright. Flashbang grenades came out of Tuppence like Sonic Rings when he fought the boss! <laughs> oh. oh man, was that the, um... Yeah, no, I'm assuming, yeah, M MGS3, I'm guessing, yeah. Yeah, because boss, yeah, no, nah, all, all good. I'm caught up now, my brain took like a weird second to process, and I was like, no, I know who boss is, that's, yeah. Man, I need to... I might do that this weekend. I might sit down this weekend and actually finish out Metal Gear Solid, the first one. Can't believe I didn't do it in one big session. But I will blame my tooth for that. Oh, no! This is alarming. Brooks, the vault sealed us in. 
Is there an override? I don't see one. Cortez? Brooks? Do you read me? Is anyone on this frequency? The short answer is no. They're not. God, I'm gonna kill him. The longer answer involves your friend trapped in Iridium Vaults and forgotten for, well, forever. <sighs> what is this? Raidberry burst. The alliance will stop you. What do you think, staff analyst Brooks? Will the alliance stop us? I wouldn't know. I don't actually like them. You bitch. I'll kill her too. The minute, the second I get out of here, I'm gonna take your head and mount it to the Normandy TIC. Yes. Then I'm gonna mount his head next to yours. Then I'm gonna take both of your heads and space them out the airlock. I will assist. That sounds very dramatic. And if someone like, say, Commander Shepard made the threat, I'd run. But not Shepard. Not anymore. You had Miranda. I have her. Mine has more bite. What? Oh, I'm assuming she's some kind of nutty, genetically engineered doing machine. You were the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. I was meant to be a snake in instrumental plan. I forgot about your entire species. You've saved more alien lives than you have humans. And all I've seen you do is end lives. You're gonna make a lousy me. <laughs> you know the one thing they can't duplicate? Our handprint. Life gets us a chip, not DNA. Which is a problem. Computer, update council records. Subject, Shepard. Human Spectre. Accessing yeah, I don't remember music for it, but I did also finish that like 10 years ago. I mean, I've got Edie as well, to be fair. Who can probably just break us out of here. Refresh my memory. Didn't we used to win these things back in the old days? <laughs> I should go. Do I sound like that? As long as I've known you. Yeah. May I suggest we concern ourselves with this Iridium vault, inside which we have been permanently sealed? more confident than he is. More in control. With me, it's more like, that's all for now. <laughs> like a Krogan. Show him who's boss. At most, we have an hour's worth of air remaining. Or sometime, I'll talk to you later. Because you know what? I never do. Who's wanting more? <laughs> Shepard, I would advise greater concern about our situation. Hmm? Oh, Glyph, you still out there? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Unlock the <coughs> thing and go find the others. No one steals my shit. Not even me. Oh, okay. I love Shepard sometimes. Like, <clears throat> don't get me wrong. I I do always like Shepard. But there's certain times where I love Shepard. What up? Alright. Okay, we're not choosing. Alright, I was gonna take fucking... Oh no, I am choosing. Okay, but no, we're taking Rex for sure. Because if he's gonna hit motherfuckers so hard that rings come out of him... Ah, uh, it's always... And you know what, we're gonna take Liara. Because she can fucking body blast down an entire corridor. Back up, Caden. Joker will come back for you. I promise.
She's using the right squad to compliment you. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's go. Now, so this is Rex. Right. Uh, I don't think we really need to worry about it with Rex because he's, he's, yeah, he's not going to be hanging out. Uh, uh, modify. Hang on, actually. Go with that one. Then modify. There we go. Go with that one. All right, let's go. It's okay, Edie, you can accompany me as a consolation prize. Man, I'd have Edie accompanying me to most personal engagements, I think. We can agree on that, Joker. Damn right. You go kill the crap out of him. You. Okay, Citadel systems are targeting the car. Any closer and they open fire. Get back and pick up the others. ASAP. Right. They can't have gotten far. Unless they called a cab or something. Ah! You imagine that fucking you bust up the like you know you pop up for an Uber, fucking shows up and sees that pile of fucking weirdos. Bump, bump, bump. Oh shit! Oh no! 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 Oh. oh, okay, so once again, used to using magic. Uh, was trying to knock them off the uh, platform. I mean, I'm shooting him in the tooties. Motherfuckers, their shields. Ah, fuck. <clears throat> also, it doesn't really explain where the other shepherd got his resources from, but anyway. Actually, I do think I need more shield at this point. Oh. Oh. Okay, we good. We good. We good. We need to hurry, they're getting ready to take off. Those motherfuckers. We want to take off as a half hour of pre flight checks. They just gun the engine and go. Your engineers keep the Normandy in fine condition. Most of the checks are unnecessary. Okay, now now get in the cover. Okay. Rex just appears up there. Alright. Prince, I don't see 
Raven. Wait. What? Uh. You were just on the Normandy. You you fired me. Dishonorable discharge for conduct unbecoming. You kicked me off the ship with barely enough time to grab my toothbrush. Oh, you and your fucking toothbrush. I can't fire you without a disciplinary hearing trainer. And really, the first thing you grab is your toothbrush. It's a Cision Pro Mark IV and uses Mass Effect builds to break up plastic. Yeah, you said. Someone just threw me off the ship. If it wasn't you. Shepard's got a clone. Makes sense when you think about it. <laughs> I love you, Rex. I can explain more later. For now. It's sealed. The Normandy's about to take off. Is there anyone still aboard who can help us? Rex just fucking got through that door. Normandy retrofits back on Earth. Everyone else is on shore leave. Okay. You know the ship inside and out. Can you get me inside? There's an emergency exit hatch for evacuations. It should be right here. And Rex just got in. Rex has got to be fucking shit up. Manual lock. And it's only meant to be open from the other side. Any ideas? I could try a biotic field, but I don't think I have the fine control required to trigger it. You and your fucking toothbrush. Rex boy, yeah, that's it. How you doing, man? Oh, we taking off? I said Rex got in. He's got to be ruining shit right now, right? He says, "Get off my tail." <laughs> I mean, I'm killing them both, so, you know. Find him. Slow him down. Like, I'm going to turn up and kill them all. So it's just, you know, kind of semantics at this point. Oh, Rex is here with us. Remind me later. A little cramped in here. Quiet. Can't risk them hearing us up top. Yeah, yeah. Get off my tail. <laughs> there it is. That's what you're talking about. Also, that's a Steve Blum voice. There's a lot of Steve Blum voices in the series. That, I wasn't ready for it to auto-target that guy there, so that really messed me up. Oh, God, this guy is... Ah, well, yeah! No, we're good. And it isn't even my birthday. He's such a champ. No, no, no. There we go. Oh. He said the thing. God, I love this gun so much. This is the real Shepard. I need you to lock down the Normandy. Can you help us out? Edie, do you copy? Please send this to an animal shelter for proper disposal. The warship is not an appropriate... Oh, that is not okay. 
That's, yeah, those motherfuckers, they can't send away my space hamster. I went to a lot of effort to get that space hamster. I went to heaps of effort to get that hamster, actually. I, I like, unloaded and came back and everything. <laughs> and we should probably deal with him first, huh? All right, sit tight, little guy. Anybody gives you trouble, go for the eyes. Go for the eyes! Oh man, means can boo. Man, Baldur's Gate Two is so good. I mean, it's probably valid numbers. I love it. Yeah, no, that is actually so good. I believe the toothbrush came in handy, too. That's brilliant. So the toothbrush came in handy. Uh, Shepard spent a lot of time going, yeah, my hamster. That's good. I like it. What up, dick nuts? He just started blasting. Good on him. Oh shit, okay. Who's my romance? I'm going back to Jack again. Because Jack was my romance in two and I've been uh, making sure I talk to her again. Jeez, oh, they're fucking everywhere. Okay. Fucking nah. Oh, she just got fucking taken down. <laughs> oh, come on. Die. Oh, you, you pop shields, damn it. Oh, 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 dude. Ha! Oh, God, I thought I was going to jump out of there. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Fucking Brooks yelling at me I'd die in the sushi place. Forget you. Uh, but yeah, no, I'm, I'm going back to Jack in this one, man. I uh, Jack was my romance in number two. And uh, I can't remember how far you get with any of that stuff in this one, but I am... Uh, yeah, running back with a in three if I can. What the hell's going on up there? Get us out of the nebula and jump to FDL. We can't. A sky car keeps blocking our path. Lol. Then shoot it. That's some citadel damage right there. <laughs> Cortez and Joker just having it out. These poor motherfuckers in these buildings.
Oh. You need to be careful around the cargo ramp. That seems like the perfect place to throw this motherfucker. Oh my god! He has so much grenade! No! Oh god, okay. Oh, that's right. Brooks is there too, somewhere. Oh God! <laughs> you have minions is correct. Oh! Oh, come on! Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh, I might have shafted myself here. Oh, go, Shepard. Fuck. Oh, the controls. Okay. No, we're good. We, we're alive. Vaguely. Oh, shit. Went to the thing. Went to the... Oh. <laughs> okay let me let me fucking renegade action all over this bitch's face look at you what makes you so damn special I wasn't grown for spare parts you bastard I was going to say, did she get taken out or? Nope. She said, fuck you. Thanks. What about this hijack? You. Get off my ship. <laughs> he slammed into a building. That okay. Haven't finished it? No, I haven't finished it, party. There's, there's plenty of game to go. Fortunately, they weren't here long enough to do much real damage. Although I may need some help from James cleaning up the damage to the shuttle bay. Plus, they overloaded the heat diffusion system firing at us. Not sure if you noticed, but shuttle guy here did some crazy stunt flying to keep us in one piece. Mm. It's nice to fly something a little more maneuverable than the Kodiak. What about Edie? Is she back online? I am once again fully in control of the Renegade. Yeah, go on, Renegade. Glad to hear it. What about the Mercs? Any survivors? <laughs> For life. Yes, <laughs> pilot and her. Alliance has taken her to a high security facility. Maybe she can give them some dirt on Cerberus. I'll be more than happy to cooperate with the authorities. Until you escape. Me? Escape? But I'm not a field agent. Stop. Just stop. You betrayed me and the Alliance in the middle of a war. I was young and naive. Headbutt. Right in the nose. You're missing. Yeah. Yeah. As if I was going to not do that one. Not at this range, I won't. Ha ha ha!
Yeah, there was no way I was going to let that go. Fuck. Like, I don't, I'm like, I'm running, you know. I'm running Renegade pretty hard, but there was no way even on a good guy run I could let her walk off. If Rex suits, shoots or he says, you're getting slow! <laughs> Appreciate it. Well, as surely it goes, this hasn't been the most relaxing. <laughs> Come on. Maybe we can take some actual time off. No explosions or anything. Just us. Don't know about no explosions. Alright, so yeah, I'm guessing that was like some kind of fucking DLC or something that I don't remember doing. So, after a hard day spent fighting an evil clone, you know what comes next. Sushi? Please, we party down. Well, I gotta get going. Things to settle up before I head back to Tachanka. All those fires to put out when you're in charge, right? Let me know if you want to hang out or if you're having that party. See ya. Party, huh? Well, no pressure. No one's gonna make you throw a party. Just do it. All right. Good idea. Let's set it up. Uh, you almost beat the game. I'm somewhere here. Purchase of any celebratory supplies, Commander. I, uh, I'm not actually sure how much game I've got left right now. Okay. Edie and Cortez and Trainer are in. What? I have also informed Dr. Tassoni about any potential upcoming celebrations. Wait. Wait, I'm in charge of the guest list. Shepard, you know you're just going to say everyone anyway. An invite button on this thing? All right. But when it's time, I invite the rest. What? Cortez just invited James. So... Ha! Ah! <laughs> Fine. I'm going to go out and see how much trouble I can get into without snapping a femur. Members of your crew have expressed interest in spending time with you, Commander. You can check your private terminal for messages. Let's do this mission and throw the party before taking back Earth. In addition to the casino, you have also been granted a complimentary pass to the combat simulator. Of course I have. Thanks, Cliff. Guess I should take advantage of some shore leave myself. No, no, I think I've got a, I think I've got a decent, a decent kind of bump left in this game, so. I've been doing as many of the side missions as I can before, uh, before actually keeping on jumping in. Hey, some Krios. Council, Memorial, Profit to conduct this as part of Normandy. Hang on. Where does hell does not so matter how much it attends? I want you to be there as well as those people in Normandy, me and my father. Right. Oh shit, so Thane's like fucking dead. Alright, there we go. Your presence has been requested concerning an incident involving a Krogan identified as Grant. <laughs> Sees the girl from Sorrel to see the Silver Sun Strip, right? Armex Arsenal. Huge fans. How much we value. Fight against. Reskinned. Right, okay. Oh no, it's a lamp. I thought he had a phone all the way out there. Oh, is it time? That's not too bad. Oh, this is like. Oh, okay, hang on. I need to. I gotta, I gotta do my, uh, do my place up a little bit first. Where 
we're happy to fulfill all your household needs. Of course you are. It's money. Yeah, I don't remember this mission at all. Like, coming in and having a party and stuff. Like, it's just not in my brain right now. Right, where was the... Where was the modifying house button? Hey! Hey, doing Neville? Hey, how was your 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 how'd your stream go, man? How'd uh, how'd that all go for you? You, uh, I know you're playing Pokemans, and from the sound of it, you moved to another Miku game. Welcome in Raiders. Went pretty well. Nice. 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 I'm glad it went well. I'm trying to figure out how to decorate Shepard's house. Decorate Shepard's house. Uh, went for, yeah, the Rhythm Miku game to finish stream. Nice. Nice. Here, I'm trying to figure out how to decorate my house right now, and it's uh, it's eluding me. Do I go back to my personal thing? How you going, with Pokemon at the moment? I know you uh, I know you said that you got uh, kicked around. Kicked around, hoping Shepard sheps the pards. He's shepped the pards pretty good tonight, to be honest. Uh, I'm just, like I said, having trouble figuring out how to redecorate my house. Because I know it's a thing. Oh, there we go. Okay. All right, Nibble, you go get some rest, man. I figure you've been up for a while. Oh, jeez. Uh, posh. The word posh appearing in an American game seems weird. All right, we've made some changes. Yeah, you go get some rest, Neville. Thank you so much for the raid, man. Kitchen's looking a little brighter. We got Ottomans all over the place, which I think is a better choice than the office chairs. Uh, oh, hang on. That's right, there was like an invite up button somewhere here. Oh, it's Collier. Yeah, sure. Come on over, Collier. We are gathered here. Oh shoot, we got buddies. Fame touched each of our lives in different ways. The counselor knew him as a hero. The Normandy's crew knew him as a brother in arms. And others as a father. He didn't even bother putting on a shirt. He just went with it. There's an old human saying. Whoever saves one life saves the world in time. It's not about a planet, but the value of each of us. I don't know how many times Thane saved my life or I saved his when we were beyond the Omega-4 relay. Oh shit, we got him. I just wanted to give Nibble that shout out there. Oh, my whole world could have come to an end then it didn't. Uh, he set an example. Terminally ill and had no business fighting on. Something in Thane told him he could save one last life. It was not his own. Thane was too selfless for that. The life he chose was someone's whose decisions could, in fact, save worlds entire. 
That's a bit egotistical, Shepard. <clears throat> Baba Yaga. He's that Keanu Reeves of aliens. Did you steal his pants? It's the same getup. Yeah. But when he prevented me from from hurting someone, he had changed. He said enemies and ego are not as important as loved ones. I didn't want to hear it. I was lost. I called him a hypocrite in a thousand different ways. Said that he was going soft. Now, I think maybe he did have it all figured out. That's all I can say. If anyone would like to continue, we'll be here. Ba -bum. Looks like people are starting to clear out. Commander, thank you for holding this event. In time, it will be a good memory. I mean, good timing on it, Colliet. He was one of us. Like, I, I literally just got a fucking place. If you want me, wow! I was like, that's the nice option. Then <laughs> Shepard's like, I'll fucking kill him. Ugh. My odds are good. Oh, before I go, I was organizing my father's possessions, and I came upon copies of video messages he tried to send you. I sent them to your extranet address. <sighs> I hope they help more than they hurt. Until we meet again, Commander. And they're gone. All right, check and message yours. Why did it send me up here to check messages? Oh, TV time. Static on a digital TV, fuck yeah. Unless they're still using analog out in the galaxy. Incorrect. This message finds you well. As for me, I have moved into an apartment on the Citadel not far from Kolyat. I think the first attack I had frightened him. I will spare you the details. It seemed very dramatic at the time. But in comparison to the Omega Relay, it was a child's game. Well, in any case, I mean... Everything in comparison to the Omega Relay was a child's game. Like, that's, you know. Shepard, if you sent a message back, I didn't get it. I suppose communications from someone of my reputation would be restricted. The irony is, I am a danger to no one these days. 
I am even paying taxes on my investments. Ha! Ah! I can't expect you I'm even paying taxes. He knows what's going on. He has no significant other, and he is temperamental. But he is employed and staying out of crime. I can tell he is serious about changing. Hasn't got a mate, and he's mad. Okay. Third one, he's like hunched over and bleeding everywhere and shit. I tried a false identity to try to get this message through to you. We'll see if it works. I have good news and bad. The good news is that Kolyat and I took a few days to visit Earth. Light shaded her eyes. Shrill sound of chirping stops. I scan the ground. See two tiny bodies locked by claws. Excuse me. As I was saying. We saw a beautiful sunset in New Mexico and a scorpion eating a cricket. Ha! I wish you could have joined. Scorpions me. eating crickets! The bad news is, I had. I fainted and struck my head. Colyot has convinced me to stay at Huerta Memorial on the Citadel. I will be there from now on. I still don't want to die in a hospital. But it's where the doctors are. Wow, that sucked. Um, yeah, all right, cool. Oh, that. Oh, okay. No, we good. We good. We good. Oh, that's right. Miranda want to see me on the Citadel too. Wait, where are we? Oh, jeez. Yeah, no, okay. Yeah, that wasn't that volus. Sarah's ca Okay, guys, calm down. Who are you? Oh. It's, it's, oh yeah, that's right, it was Grunt, so we gotta see what Grunt says. What's Grunt fucking doing at the Noodle House? That's such a cool logo, the Krogan with the leggy legs. Grunt. Anything you want to tell me about? Uh, this clown wants to take me to lockup. Figured I'd give you a call, straighten this out. Commander Shepard, I apologize for the intrusion. This Krogan insisted we contact you. Yeah, but why? What's going on? Sign any paperwork you have, officer. Yes, sir. Oh, that's it. That's fucking it. Okay. I don't know. Drank a bit, left the hospital, broke a few windows. But you were in that hospital recovering from the Ragnar encounter. Yeah. Didn't feel like sticking around. Most people stick around long enough to, you know, heal. <laughs> Most people aren't me. And why is CSEC here? Guess they're precious about some broken glass. Before I sign you up, everybody walked away from this in one piece, right? Sure, yeah, everybody's fine. Hospital seen better days, though. I broke the windows in the fucking hospital, jeez. Tell me about the windows. A couple of squad mates broke me out for my birthday, tried lowering me down. The oh, wow, well, that's funny as fuck. Oh, guys. When CSEC got there, they were mad. Or maybe they were mad about their car being on fire. I can't remember. Oh, those Krogans had a hell of a day out. I threw my bottle of ring call at it. Pretty strong stuff. It went up like a bonfire. Fuck. Yeah. I love you, Grumpy. You're a mess. God damn it, Grunt. 
And why is that? Because I was on fire. You know, from the... Because <laughs> I was on fire! <laughs> Fuck! So how did they catch you? Got hungry. Bought some noodles. Grunt, you apologized to the nice man for setting his car on fire. Fine. I'm sorry for setting your car on fire. <laughs> Me looks like a fucking kid. And I won't do it again. Good. Uh, now, officer, I can pay for any damages that may have occurred. That's what you've been signing for, Commander. You're lucky, Krogan. Don't let me catch you up here again. You won't. Thank you, officer. <sighs> so, how were those noodles? A little spicy. <laughs> You're my hero, Grunt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck, I love Grunt. Grunt is such a good boy. Grunt is, yeah, <laughs> Grunt is also the good boy after Rex. Wait, where am I going? And I should, wait, where's, hang on. Where am I going? What's six? Castle Arcade. Hang on, where's my, where's my fucking journal? <sighs> I mean, there's a bunch. Oh, I just moved my fucking jaw wrong and it made my whole fucking mouth just receive pain just then. Oh. Uh, no. Fucking gamer, take that. Give him the gamer, take that. Oh. Yeah, where am I? Where am I going? Even fuck. What was it eight? Bah. Okay, no, I feel like I've gone the wrong way. Can I get down there? No. Right. Okay, maybe I do go in here? Hey, nice that oh, his name's Crud. Okay. Uh, ooh. I just buy it there. Hang on, I'll, I'll do, I'll wait for Joker. I'll see what Joker says. So I have no idea how this goes. I was here when Cerberus attacked, and I don't remember seeing you. I think I caught a glimpse of Commander Shepard fighting over by the elevator bay, though. Well, yeah, Shepard was protecting the council, but I had my own problems to deal with. <laughs> see, I was down by the docking bay near C-Sec headquarters. What is he gonna say? Commander Shepard is chasing the council. This is our chance. What the fuck is this? Cerberus. <laughs> it's Joker. He can barely walk. How's he going to stop us? 
<laughs> oh. Wow, Joker. This is joking time. It's joking time. What do you mean? <laughs> this is actually the coolest mission. <laughs> Look. The island of Dr. Me? I'm going to say that at some point. Wow. Everyone in this room owes him their lives, myself included. I'm so sorry, Commander. I had no idea. Wow, that was very staunch. Uh, thanks, Commander. You can pay me back later. Wait, so does that mean that. Mm. <laughs> How you doing, Imperial? Ugh. Uh, you can't get me anything, because I'm now going to do laps of everywhere, looking for fucking people to hang out with. Because this has just made me go, wait a minute. What do you mean that was just a wait for Joker social interaction? That's a real thin Krogan. Yeah. You've been here the whole time just playing a lot or not. Yeah. <laughs> I do kind of feel like I might need to check it out. Yeah, I'm starting to feel like I need to check out Lord or not. It is it is taking up quite a bit of your time. What up, lads? You love it. Uh I think about twenty three dollars on Steam, so yeah, well the sales on Steam are pretty good at the moment, so I'm just taking the lap around to see if... I said there was a, like, fucking hangout with Joker button. I feel like there could be hangout with other people button. It's a very chilled out game. Good. Honestly, I, I keep thinking that I need more of them. More, like, actually chilled out, like, whatever games. Okay. Did you catch the updated intel report about slipping into the system? Floor gap. Fuck yeah. Okay, so. That one. Music track for apartment? All right. Oh, there's like a fucking... Oh, because they change color and it locks when you push the A button. Congratulations. You're a winner. <coughs> nah. 
It's getting nothing but positive reviews, so get in before it gets really popular. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and it came out last month. Yeah, no, I like I said, I haven't seen anything of it. Like, I, uh, yeah, hadn't heard of it at all. No, that's out this way. Starting to think. That there isn't any more hang out with people options here. Nah, I'm not doing it. Nah. Nah. Want to treat the whole family can enjoy? Bring them to a combat thing. Oh, they're just like fucking combats. Okay. Nah. All right, we good. We good. I think we might go on through that party. Just jump on YouTube and look at some gameplay. I did see that it had a demo as well. I think. Which is always a good time. Okay, we're just going to save real quick in case there was something I should have done. You finish the demo in an hour and you need more. I mean, that's always good. Like, if you can play a demo and then go, fuck yeah, I need to do some more of it, that's always a good sign. Piles of green flags. Uh, oh, shit. Hang on. I'm going to see if I can't fucking go see Miranda. Because I think she sent me a message. And her... Signal party was signed up. Uh, threshold. Signal material code. Signal gaming technology. I mean, or not. No, guess not. You can pet the lottles. <laughs> Actually, I will admit, I did spend the last few days, like, while I was playing Hogwarts Legacy, patting cats every chance I got, so. <laughs> no! Okay, let's see how Shepherd parties. Send invitations. I mean, why wouldn't I invite these people? What sort of party are you hoping to have tonight, Commander? I could set things up for quiet conversation, or would you prefer a more energetic evening? Uh, energetic. Fuck it. Time to blow off some steam. Excellent choice, Commander. Allow me to queue up a series of popular nightclub tracks and drink lists. Sure. Also modify my appearance to be more festive. The fuck are you going to do? He's going to RGB himself. You've almost finished it now so you can ask him <laughs> I'll have to take a look at it, yeah. What up, ED? Hey, come on in. Thanks for coming. Thanks for the invite. Make yourselves at home. Thank Yo, Liara. <clears throat> He's already shit faced. That's brilliant. Jack! Man, this music is hot. The right music sets the tone for the whole party, right, Esteban? Sure. My parties are always a little hit and miss, to be honest. Stick with me, bud. I'm a party legend. Back in school, they called me Party Vega. That's probably before they started calling you Meat Man.
It was basically everyone with biotics. Oh, Caden. So what does happen to a biotic when they're completely borracho? Stick around, muscles. Maybe you'll find out. Yeah, muscles. I like that. Hey, <laughs> thanks for doing this. I kind of needed to unwind a bit for a night. That's fine, Jack, as long as... I mean, I've got like three beds. And none of them have been used properly yet, Jack, so... There you go. Alright. Ah, ah! I won't talk to Jack. I also need a drink. I feel a bit weird about the fact that Joker's just standing over here with Edie and that's it. Joker, if you're trying to hit that robot, you, know, you need to not say stuff like that. What specific time period are you referring to, Jack? Hey, Commander, this is Cerberus. We were studying some Rachni, and they got loose and killed all our guys. <laughs> yeah, that was a pretty fun time. Oh, it was a death state. Got loose and started killing all their guys. He raises a valid point. It's a it's a fucking repeating cycle. I jump off you're gonna be dreaming about Lottles now. That's fair. Have a good one, Imperial. I'll, uh, I'm hoping that I can get some better sleep than last night with this fucking tooth, to be honest. So, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna kick around for a little bit more. Wow, you're a dick tip. I'll see what I can do. You know if that waterfall is warm water or cold. Commander. Okay. I can't get over the size of this apartment. The electric bill alone could have paid for my college tuition. I mean, that's some cheap college. That's true, you know Kelly Chambers. Well, if I know people, sure, but some of your friends are legends. I can't just ask if they've tried the hummus. Yeah, you can. Also, Dr. Chuckless apologizes for not being here. It's some emergency medical consult on the Citadel. Oh, it's something I'm going to have to deal with, isn't it? It was great. Wish you could have had some. He already drank it. That would have been the Ceres Ice Brandy, too. Fuck. Okay, let's just quickly do the rounds, make sure no one's vomiting. I don't have to clean that up. Uh, it's too warm to sleep. It is too fucking warm to sleep. 
Wait, who just said they lost a bet? Also, I guarantee that fucking this is annoying the shit out of the neighbours that he used to everyone being kind of fucking quiet here. Or, you know, good old Anderson. Alright, they're up there. Eh. So who is strongest, you or the tank break? What I miss? The pro kid here wants to know who would win in a fight between me and Brax. It's a good question. Oh, it's not a good question. Baby I don't want to, I don't know, because if they fight, that's going to fuck up my whole house. Hey, Earth Daughter, how you doing? You could defeat at the glass of warm milk. <laughs> I got heavy. How's your, uh, how's your day been, Earth Daughter? I'd rather it didn't. You guys are going to fuck my house up. Yeah, exactly. See, Shepard's like, no, you're going to fuck the house up. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I hope your day's doing well, Earth Daughter. Pretty sure it doesn't exist anymore, Rex. Uh, okay, do the rounds, check for stooges. See, no, the shower there feels really boring when you've got, like, the jacuzzi thing in the other one. Oh, hey, like, actual reflection. Don't know why I didn't process that before. Just don't think I expected it in a game this old. Okay. Your guests appear to be getting rowdy, Commander. Would you like me to change the intensity of the atmosphere? No. I want to check on a few things before we change things up. Certainly, Commander. Oh, he put a bow tie on. I thought he was going to like RGB or something. Uh, you know what? Let's go. Let's send it. Party's just starting. Let's turn it up. This seems like a bad idea, but it could be funny. I heard there's a big party in there. Can we come in? No, you can't. Go away. <laughs> How's it going over? <clears throat> you can't come in. It's going good. <laughs> He's enjoying that. <laughs> no. Can I try that? Sure. <laughs> Press this button and say no. <laughs> no. Great work. I love Grunt. Thanks. No. See, easy. Keep up the good work. Will do. I told you already. No. I love Grunt so much. Thanks for the invite. Never been to a human party before. Fuck, he's good. Fuck, he's good. <laughs> oh, Grunt is so good. Okay, once again, I'm just doing laps. Just doing laps, see what everyone here is doing. <clears throat> also, like, kind of massive legendary figures from the Normandy having a party. You're not... You're not turning up. Like, let's be real. You're not. You're not turning up, guys. Worst planet to get shot down over. We're talking pre-war. Pre-war, life-bearing worlds only. Uh, I'm going with Tarif. Garden world, yes, but it's got those chlorine swamps. I will see your Tarif and raise you a Zoria. Home of toxic spores and athletes' lungs. Neither of you. 
Hey guys, talk to Chop. No worries, this is fun for us. So, you don't have a sidearm under your pilot's chair? The weapons locker is on the bridge, practically right there. Yeah, but that makes a lot of sense. Get to is no weapon at all. When's the last time you trained with a handgun? Sometime before I got the ass kicking robot as my co pilot. Mm. What if you have to save Edie someday? Unacceptable. It's valid. <laughs> Rick's calling it a man emergency is nuts. Some range time will fix you up. Right, Commander? You are not taking me shooting. My testosterone levels are plenty high. I fly a deadly war machine, remember? Ah, uh, Nah, Cortez. I'm surprised at you. What about the collector attack? The bridge can get dangerous. Hey, they totally proved my point. If I'd fired off a shot then, I would have been mobbed. The real weapon is your brain. Take that away, you got nothing. Still would have been nice to have a little backup at the sushi bar. <laughs> well, there's a combat simulator on the Citadel. Hell no. Maybe a shooting range if we're not letting this go. Maybe. But not while I'm wasted. Or hungover. Hungover is the perfect time to train. <laughs> Makes you angry at loud noises. Fuck you. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Great party. I'd better see you out on the dance floor later. Mm. We'll see. You know, no one needs to see Shepard on the dance floor. There's anything stronger behind the bar. Too many things to break in here. Could be a fun. Rex, sit down. What kind of music is this? That's not that club crap, is it? I don't, I don't know what else you want. My choices were like... Keep it low key or play this, so. Absolutely. Biotics are impressive. I'm not saying they are. You're just saying that they're not that impressive. I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying. Oh, shit. Yeah, you fucked it up, Freddy. Fucking meat man. Hey, what's going on here? Everyone playing nice? Of course, Shepard. Oh. James was just explaining how physical conditioning trumps biotics. Mmm, yeah, I don't, don't know about that. Biotics are strong, but unpredictable. All that cooling down. Yeah. Big guy. A person can improve their physique, but biotics, they are what they are. And what about our poor friends stuck with flawed implants? Wait, what? You're not talking about me, are you? Oh, dude. I may be L2, but I've worked very hard. And now I can read. Really? Huh. That's a bit strange. Okay, okay. Maybe it's not conditioning exactly. Maybe it's just the condition of one James Baker. Oh, fuck off, dude. Check it out. This guy here never has to cool down. In fact, the hotter, the better. Oh, dude. We're still talking about combat, right? <laughs> James. No, nah, we got... No, nah, Biotic should... This is a no-brainer. Yeah. around you. That had to be an argument you couldn't win. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, well, you win some, you lose some. And you lose a lot, my, meat man. Next? Help yourselves. You lose quite a bit, buddy. Hey, <laughs> need me to do anything? Uh, food run, change the music, check on ice. Dude, stop trying to be helpful, man. I know it's your whole thing. Don't fucking touch it. Don't you fucking touch it, Caden. I'll throw you in a bin. Oh, these two. Yeah. We've all had to ask that at one time or another. Wow. Not all of us can do that, though. That'd be funny as fuck. What's wrong, dude? I am asking Specialist Trainer about why she found my voice sexually attractive. On one occasion, 
I like the zero shame. Pin your voice against the wall and run your tongue against its collarbone. Okay. You were talking about quantum entanglement and I didn't know you were an AI. Yo. Anyway, I was just joking. You know, stress of the retrofits and... Really? My diagnostic suggested that you were genuinely aroused. Ha <laughs> ha! Diagnostics. Oh. <sighs> fair is fair, trainer. Edie has a right to ask about what you said. Yeah, it's pretty fair. But funny. I apologize for saying that I wanted to roll naked with your voice in certain shoes. Oh, I was not offended. In fact, it was flattering. Even the part where I wanted to grab your voice by the hair and nibble my way down its back. That is a weird thing to start saying. That about a, a voice with nobody. Like, that is that is that is a bit far when the voice has nobody. Like, none at all. It just It's just a synthesized nothing voice. Uh, check on the news. Check on your boss. I think she's involved in a competition upstairs. I will locate Dr. Tassoni right away. I don't know. I just knew that there was going to be like another option to do stuff and things. Oh, this is going to be awful. Oh, no, don't just go and stand in the middle, dude. You're going to be worse than going... What is... Oh, he's doing the... He's doing the little shuffle! Very <laughs> Good. Well, you're not going to want to after this. <laughs> Jack, you got that. <laughs> that's, I'm sorry, that's the best call that's been made in this entire fucking game is Jack saying that about what, uh, about what her and Shepard are doing on that table later. Oh, that was brilliant. Oh. <laughs> Oh man, if you guys are only just starting to get shit faced, then you guys have failed, not me. What the fuck are you doing, Rex? What the fuck? <laughs> Rex! Jeremy, calm the fuck down! This happens at Krogan parties all the time. And yet I'm still not comfortable. Hanging out with, <laughs> with his gun blown out. Oh. Oh, man. I mean, don't get me wrong. If there's anyone that I trust with weapons, it's probably Rex, but still. Wow! The Prothean Empire will rise again. Oh, what are you guys doing? So he won't dance with you, huh? Hello, Shepard. He will not. <laughs> he will not! <laughs> wow, Shepard threatens to dance with his woman and he laughs at him. Even Edie's done with that one. 
Yavik is just everyone's drunk racist uncle. Pretty much. He's the drunkle of the group. All the time. Seriously, no, don't go there. <laughs> Come on, Joker. Support dancing. Dancing support. Done. Joker. No. Come on. No. Seriously? Oh, fine. Get a Joker for morale. Okay, Joker, you cannot make fun of Shepard right now. You basically have the same little dad hop. Oh, yes. He's going to get it, though. He's going to get it. Gonna wake up with a fucking broken collarbone because Edie's been sitting on it. I assure you, Dr. Tassoni is quite capable. Bleh! Okay, now it's starting. What's up? Just proving a point. I think James has a newfound respect for biotics. You okay, James? Yeah, this is trippy. I'm kinda of buzzing all over. Do you find Get that Rabussi? Oh, dude, that's just weird. Can I have a turn? my full crew back when the night's over. Okay, you've had your fun. Put me down now. Come on, let's dance. Jesus, they fucking started real quick. Okay, let's. I think I've. I think I've done the blaster, everyone. Oh man, I guess like if I left this until after I did Miranda's thing and stuff, they'd all be here too, but fuck them. We're good. Okay, there was Taker. Hey, everyone. Come over here for a minute. Let's get a photo to remember you. Arrange yourselves on the sofa. Arrange yourselves on the sofa. Why does your vest look like it's look like it's made of skin? Because it very possibly is. <laughs> Rex is super pumped about being in the photo. Of course. If you could all please direct your attention this Meat Man is the queerest answer in the whole party by a fair margin. Yeah, correct. He he outstrips Cortez so hard. See, look at that. Shepard and Jack, gonna get it. Kale, okay, please tell me you were there. For when Jack was telling Cortez about what her and Shepard are gonna gonna do on the table, because please tell me you were good. Just the yes, success. I mean, they still got their clothes on, but success. Appreciate arrange yourself on the sofa. Yeah, arrange yourself on the sofa. <laughs> you want me to find some vodka and we can go again? Ha! Shepard's fucked. I'm sorry, like... Yeah, Final Fantasy... Ba -ba 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 Shepard, like, bounces out and swings his fucking Omni fucking thing around. Omni blade around. Oh, hello, Yavik. Uh, time to leave the galaxy now. Kneel before Jack. I... Oh, dude. I was alone. Primitives had hope. Yeah. Solarian, Turian, the Asari. Dude. The Ara. And those eyes. Voice. She was blue. No. It was just a dream. He a thirsty boy. You've only got three fingers, dude. You can't talk shit to anyone. Uh, <laughs> I love the bottles there. Oh, that's so good. Oh, shit. Everyone's awake. Did we uh, break anything last night? I don't Get a Javik. Get you some primitives. <laughs> yeah, okay. Maybe I should just stop saying that word. But only if Liara stops saying. Part of the Carters. 
That's not good. Liara takes forever to do her um, hair or whatever she called it. I was actually thinking on that. As much as like those things that Asari have aren't like hair, you've got to assume that there would be crevice cleaning involved. So, what up? Alright. Oh, I was kind of hoping that, like, Grunt would be face down on that fucking bed or something. Toothbrush or water pee? <laughs> Do you think? It'd be, like... Uh, I don't know, maybe it'd be, like, a cotton bud jobby, like, toothbrush kind of deal? Oh, then again, maybe they'd also, like, maybe they'd made, like, a tool for it by now. Because they would have used them for a while. So last night I didn't do anything, did I? I'm checking extranet sites. No hits yet. So maybe I just imagined that last part. Okay, that's a bit rough if you're uh. Thanks for the, uh, thanks for the follow, Amerislev. How you doing, man? How's your day going? Cotton bud jobby, like a blowjob or a Scottish jobby. Those ultrasonic water stuff. That, oh, yeah, those ultrasonic water things. That's probably it, actually. Like, something like that to fucking... That'd make a lot more sense. But yeah, how you doing, Amerislev? How's your day going? I said, thank you very much for the follow, man. Yes. Okay, who wants eggs? They are eggs, trainers, Esteban, eggs, Joker. Where is that guy? Kid, here's some eggs to go with that cup. Rex, buddy, eggs, Javid, man. I've been looking around for some Mass Effect streamers. Love this game series. Pretty much been your go to for years now. Yeah, man, I, uh. Shepard? Yeah, I started at one. Obviously, keeping on running. I'm, I'm going through three now. Uh, I, I played them all back in the day, so this is, <laughs> this is a nice nostalgia run for me. What do you mean bathrooms? What did you do in the bathroom, Grunt? Oh, who's, oh, hello, Jack. He did a number four. Oh, uh, yeah, a number four is about no, I'm, I'm talking to Jack last. I can't, because I'm going to talk to Jack and then I'm going to turn around and say, Everyone get out! Oh, morning, Shepard. I hope you slept well. Didn't need to sleep much, buddy. I would have thought all those tequila shots with James would have prepared me for last night. What a night. I should never end it. It was a good mission. I like that. I don't think I ever did that. She getting pumped up for round <laughs> two. Yeah, yeah, we can hope. Um, hey, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you for that. Thank you for the 245. That's awesome, man. Thanks so much. Very, uh, very grateful. I'd completely forgot what I'd even said as the gifts and alerts for those. So that's, that's hilarious. But yeah, no, thanks so much for that, man. I feel like Joker would break some ribs if he threw up. Just not talk so loudly, that would be great. Or close the cupboards too loud. Or walk too loud. You know, just, just think quiet thoughts. Ugh. It's still fun, though. Nice to the small streams. Yeah, no, that's that's awesome. I, I love to see it. Like, I, I, know, I mean, I know obviously we do, but it's like, you know, nice to feel appreciated. It's been a while since I get to It's looking like every bone, a very bone broken <laughs> Yeah. Like, you know those chickens that you, like, you put in the pan, you fucking splay out? Like, you crack the, the rib cage to, like, put them down? Full spatchcock. <laughs> ah, correct. 
All right, Rex is making... All right, we're going to go talk to Jack again. And I'm going to say, hey, Jack, how about morning round? Let's go. Hey, you look like shit. Ha! Wow, thanks. You know the best part of an overcharged biotic amp? No hangovers. Oh, that's how she's alive. Even normal biotics get hangovers. But I can drink until I puke and still wake up this peachy. Your annual hydration spent. Ha, 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 ha. Not quite. That was fun. You guys even kept up with me there for a while. I, uh... Hey. Yeah, no, I, I learnt that lesson. Hey. Hey. <coughs> I, um, I had a bit of a, bit of a fucking thing go on where one day someone got on and it was just going. It was just going and going and going and going and going. I think in about two hours, I drunk like three liters of water. And so that was the point where I said, no, <laughs> that's going away. Uh, that was, uh, that was before I figured out how to put some, uh, put some other, uh, redeems on to try and take away some bits from people. Although saying that, I think Kale's still got like 60 something thousand. So, uh, but yeah, no, I, uh, I learned that lesson real hard. 109k? What the fuck, Kale? What are you doing, bud? <laughs> I mean, don't, don't get me wrong. Oh, I'm fine with them sitting there, but holy shit, man. 109k Norkies. <laughs> Ceylon's probably pretty run down at the moment. Yeah, with it. Uh, see, every time I, uh, every time I do a, um, it's fun. That's the thing. Every time I do a uh, a big stream, and I let everyone fucking tell me to drink, uh, I know Ceylon at least drops a lot of points. Unironically, extremely unpopular opinion. Your favorite character is the Shadow Broker. <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> I mean, I'm guessing you're talking the the old one. Cause yeah, the uh, <laughs> yeah, it's you've got to see payout on your investments. Ugh. Break time's over, huh? At least we threw one hell of a party. <laughs> Probably the last yeah, the yeah. Uh, you don't know why you just feel like their design is. Oh, yeah, no, their design is awesome. God, I hate the jack had to go that way. But anyway, yeah, the um, the the design of that alien is real fucking cool, actually. Like the whole mouth thing, the way they work. Those may be unpopular with you know, dig jacks. Looking three more though. Uh, uh, yeah, no. To be fair, I'm I'm there with you on that one. I I costume wise, there was uh one in two that I liked the look of, but it wasn't on par with this one so the way that like yeah they did this one yeah so i'm um, uh, yeah that's actually kind of my my crux is that i do tend to like at least a bit of hair uh but then i also like i also i like the rest of the costume as well just seems to work a lot better because like in the first one where it's like no shirt pants and just like the suspenders over nipply bits it's one of those things where you're like, I get it for the appeal, but like, it just wouldn't work, you know? So the the costume in this one, way, way better. First place of this game is absolutely atrocious. Oh, everyone died in two, no! There was just a dread to play because nobody was alive, shit! Calculations. 
Um, no, I the first time I went through. Uh, the first one that I went through, time that I went through number two was, who died there? Um, it's not that different from organic life. Bon Genki's too much. That's kind of <laughs> Bon Genki. Um, so, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, the first time I ran through number two, first time playing, so you didn't understand the importance of the loyalty missions. Yeah, I, I did, I did do the loyalty missions, but, um. Yeah, no, nah, definitely wouldn't have been the first. I think I did, a f like, most people's loyalty missions. I think I did miss a few. And then I, when I did get into the suicide mission, I made some bad choices. So I did get, <clears throat> the first time I finished it, I did get Legion killed. And I'm pretty sure I got Thane killed. Uh, so, yeah. But then I, I like, uh, this playthrough was so, man, I am so surprised that I remembered those who to send where. Uh, I am so surprised. I was genuinely worried the whole fucking run that I was making the wrong decisions. Of all the companions you like Legion the most in Rex. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we are we we big we big Rex fans here. Good, I did get that. Uh, Legion dying is almost a Rex. Thing. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I that was the thing though. Like, I didn't realize that that was gonna be uh, um, what's the word? Like dynamic, I didn't realize that. Yeah, the the who died in that mission was gonna be, you know, up like actually up to you. And so, yeah, the first time I finished it, I lost I lost those two, and so I just kind of uh, kept going because I just went, you know what? Let's let's just go. Let's keep going. How do you see with only two eyes? Evolution has taken a strange turn. Legion isn't the best you've had. No, it can beat Garrus. <laughs> He's writing his peak. He's writing his peak. Garrus has one of the... Garrus is one of the guys that consistently, as the game goes on, is always interesting. He is, like, one of the guys that you're never mad that he's there. Like, at no point are you ever grumpy that he's there. He's just always there. All right, I gotta bring up the thing. One of your close friends, when this was coming out, was a really big Garrus. Thing. <laughs> well, Garrus is like, you know, Shepard's husband, basically. I've always loved the M35 make. Got hard so. Oh, come on, the M44 Hammerhead is vastly superior. Come on, that thing's made of tissue paper. At least a Mako can take a few hits. I'd hope so. That thing handles like a drunk rhino. No agility whatsoever. It's more like a bull that can climb and climb for days. It only climbs because of its stupid, vertically aligned mass effect field. Jump or stick. No speed. No lateral movement. Hey, with a cannon like that, who needs to move? <laughs> if you want that, why don't you just stick with the old M29 Grizzly? Hey, I love that tank. <laughs> I love that tank. Wow, he just told him that he would like bears. That's fine. Vega doesn't get it. I'm not the only person in the whole universe of Mass Effect that is a shadow break stand. Yeah, I'll admit that I uh uh yeah, I've got a lot of a lot of favorites before we go there. You had a hard time leaving Earth. Hell yeah, but I get it. We'll get back there. Alright. So I'm just popping through this because I know that well uh, they wanted me to talk to him before, but you want something? 
What's with you? I'll talk to you. Ah! Ah! No, I'm flicking through too fast. What can I do for you? I take it. I caught up with him on Earth. Just don't tell him I said. I'll talk to you later. Sure. All right. Ah! Woo! Yeah, there we go. Just doing the rounds on the ship, make sure everyone's being sorted. Critic. Kind of curious to see where Mass Effect 4 goes. Hope they might put so much effort in that the whole game is swayed. Based off your ending of... Th oh man, if they do that, I'll be all over it. Like, I'm, I'm not going to lie, I'm worried about it because... You know... Oh, Dr. Chuckwise. Okay. I'm obviously worried about it. Like, I always am whenever there's a game from a big series that I enjoy, but... What's going on, yeah, I'd like to think they'll do well with it. <sighs> They're equipped to help injured soldiers, and we have supplies to help suffering refugees. Ah. Precisely. Perhaps you could fly your charms to broker a trade. Yeah. I'll find the refugees as soon as I can. Speak with Tactus. Many of the refugees near the Citadel docks look to him for leadership. Thank you for my. They announce it, but you are worried because we most likely won't have the Shepherd Saga anymore, which trying to bring a game back without the big main character can be a doozy. Well, yeah, that was one of the reasons why they kind of stumbled when it came to Andromeda, trying to, uh, yeah, use the same franchise and and not run back to any of the characters. Uh, especially with EA having such a hand on big... Yeah, yeah, no, especially with EA being in touch with it. EA hurts. EA fucking hurts. Oh, you got the, uh, you got the ham dog. Nice. Ham dog is a good dog. Ah, uh, hang on. Long enough. I'm sure they're okay. That's the thing about getting old, Sean. Pretty soon, blind hope is all we'll have left. And I hate being blind. Okay. So I'm just making sure that we don't have anything like everything we knew about the Reapers from Saren all the way to the Collector Bay. I'm not sure even I'd believe it. I had to admit that parts of it sounded crazy, but my father just listened. It's what he did in his days at CSAC. There's only going to be four Bioist, you only. They likely Ray would have the original studio make the game. Oh, from what I think, is that EA just requires a multiplayer aspect? Okay. I mean that's that's a good sign. Like if they're if they're specifically yeah sitting in house and doing it. <laughs> thank you for the uh, anonymous. Thank you anonymous for the gift of the sub. That's awesome. There's been a bunch of gifted subs tonight. Actually, that's been awesome. Been a good night. Good night. I feel kind of bad because I've just been hanging out in the fucking Citadel all night. <laughs> Nearly at the 50. Oh, jeez, that's right. Oh, oh, no. That's going to hurt some eyes for sure. Paddle pull string. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Kale. That's, oh, that's going to... <laughs> NCT's pumped now. He's fucking in on it. Uh, look, I... I, a real long time ago, uh, we were making jokes, me and Neon City Daily and, and a few other guys, were uh, making jokes about doing a hot tub stream. And it was just one of those like dumb shenanigan ha-ha things. But then Neon City Daily went and picked up like an inflatable fucking hot tub thing and uh, and all this other shit. But then, like, it, we've gotten to a point where uh, I'm the one that tends to be streaming all the time. Hey, Shepard. Hey. And Neon City Daily had it packed away and he found it one day and went... <laughs> and he went, oh, you've got to do it, you've got to do it. And I think just out of sheer, like, fuck itness, I just said, like, oh, whatever, I'll just do it. We hit 75, we should get a hot tub stream in a tail. 
Holly, get up. Oh, jeez. No, I can't be. That'd, that'd feel like. Orem on VidCon? I don't know. Like, I kind of. It's that whole thing where, like, I keep forgetting about it. And just even forgetting that it's a thing. Also, it'd feel like far too cheap if you just started dumping them, Salem. Need, need it to feel earned. Anderson. You know you've got quite a fan club back here. Any news we hear about the Normandy gives hope to the guys in the trenches. I know it's yeah. like fighting in the dark. I'm glad we're making a difference. It's more than that. A lot of these people have never held a gun in their life. When they heard that you managed to get the Torians and Krogan to cooperate, it was a big fucking deal. Dude, I doubt it. Like, the Reapers are wrecking shit. Kind of earned you skimped out on X was only no. <laughs> no, I, I, to be fair, if I didn't have a broken tooth that I'm still dealing with, I, I was looking at doing something for that. <laughs> oh. oh. Show how all the races got in the Citadel. I'm not sure how all the races got in the Citadel, actually. Like, I, I assume they all had a fairly uh, similar to human thing where they just they found a mass relay and bounced into the middle. Thanks, Down City Daily, for the random sub. Who'd you go? The Grinder of D2. Okay. Commander. Commander. Oh, shit. Private term. Dinner? Caden? Shepard? Citadel? Dinner? Polos? Sure. Oh, that's right. I have stuff to do up there. Uh, but yeah, I'm not actually sure. I, I will admit that if there's anything that I haven't done with Mass Effect is look at all the extended kind of universe stuff. Would you like to come up? Your cabin is gorgeous. I've seen apartments smaller than this. Wait, why did I get trainer to come up? Ready to play? Oh, because she was going to play board games. Did I romance anyone in this playthrough? Kept on with Jack for this playthrough. Because, yeah, romance in two. And, uh, yeah, kept her on this one, so. Come on. My word, Commander. It's almost as though you wanted to spare your pawns the indignity of living under my regime. In real life, that tactic would have worked. Well, in real life, one doesn't move on an 8x8 eight eight square grid. You know what I mean. The pawns are infantry. A good infantry line, like the Krogan, can take a charge like that. That reminds me of a... Mm. What's the difference between Commander Shepard and a Krogan? One is an unstoppable juggernaut of head-butting destruction. And the other doesn't have a smart-ass comm officer to keep him in line. <laughs> Ooh, that's even better than the number of testicles punchlines. <laughs> I'm glad you didn't run back. They do have a quad. Rematch? Hell yeah. 
Don't worry, the law deep dive stuff of Mass Effect is a whole rabbit hole of stuff. It's almost as bad as looking through government files. Yeah, it is. It is. I can only assume that there would be lots. <laughs> oh, jeez. Thank you, Neon City Daily. I don't know why. Like, see, this is, I don't know why you want me to get my tits out, Neon City Daily. can hit the citadel is any worth it cerberus has strengthened the coup attempts with their sleeper agents if those agents have been exposed a lot of lives might have been saved we need constant exposure therapy you're no longer afraid you have seen them a lot we did spend a whole couple weeks in hotel rooms together sounds dodgy the alliance parliament is destroyed and the prime minister's dead the line of succession is getting pretty short eventually it'll just be me Daddy Milk is <laughs> close enough. Right now, it's everyone's duty to step up. Uh, close enough on the Daddy Milk is call there at the moment. Final question from Thessia. Commander, during your tribunal, some said you had Cerberus ties. Thanks for your time, Commander. This is Diana Allers for Battle Space. Good night. And oh, she's got some dead eyes. We're just fine in front of the cameras. Oh, did you think? Uh, of course you did. Me and my big mouth. I'd better get out of here before I send another wrong signal. See ya, Commander. Yeah, no. Not with those dead eyes. <laughs> James? James, I've got some time if you want to talk privately. Hey, man, All right, what do you want, mate, man? Good, James. You? Good, good. Sorry for bunches, but yeah, I'm Australian, man. Wow. So this is what I can look forward to when I get my own command. You're not getting your own command, mate, man. You want but yeah, we're, we're, I'm Australian, man. Got a few other Aussies hanging out and chatting and everything. I can't fight worth shit anymore. <laughs> you just come up here to make fun of your commander? Sorry, loco. I guess... Maybe I got some things on my mind. I, I wanted to get your opinion on something. Shoot. I can only think of him as is Fred from Scooby Doo at the moment. For you, or did you think about it before accepting? I thought about it. Seven program is a big deal, but it's also a big commitment. I mean, have you seen these scars, buddy? Best equipment, best assignments, and they expect the best in return. Yes, they do. Thanks for checking up those socials, Kale. What's going on? Somebody somewhere managed to track me down and forward an N7 commendation. It's ah. the same day the Reapers attacked Earth. You don't sound too thrilled. Well, aside from so it's probably early for you. It's 7 a.m. for you, and you've yet to sleep. No, it's it's 11 p.m. at night. I'm uh. And not because I try. Hell, I'd have kicked my ass out years ago. Last time I had a commendation, I lost almost everyone, and they promoted me. I guess I'm just not sure if I'm ready to lead again. Right. Uh, yeah, no, it's it's 11 4. I'm, I'm probably looking to uh, clean up the interactions on the ship, and I'm probably going to take off myself, go get some sleep. We were out on patrol, checking on some strange readings, and the collectors hit. But they hit the colonists. <clears throat> By the time we got back, most of the colonists had been subdued or abducted, including our CO, Captain Tony. So you were in charge. Fucking Tony! chance to strike but before we could we were betrayed One betrayed turned out to be a Cerberus spy oh god Cerberus I had no choice I killed him and destroyed the collector ship we got ugly we lost most of the colonists and all but one of my squad not exactly a textbook operation you can't blame yourself for being put in a tough situation and if you were promoted I mean to be fair too he did like survive a collector invasion which was so kind of rare Yeah, 
Did you know that before you joined the end seven? Yeah. <sighs> That's why I was asked. And it's why they asked you. That's right, because I had the whole, like, fucking soul survivor thing. No, that's, uh, that's, uh, oh. God, I've got to go back to the Citadel again. Yeah, just go. Uh, let's just go to the Alliance docks for now. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? Let's not. You've been trying to start streaming, but you're like a Mass Effect nerd, so it's quite hard to start streaming, especially on a dead game. <laughs> Man, I look, I the amount of dead games that I've played just because I like playing them. I mean, I yeah. I can't I'm like my I'm immediately brain fried and can't remember anything I've played. But I mean, let's this I went through Mad Max, the 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 game that no one knows about just underrated as fuck. Given the people know about the new one, probably going to be a lot of interest in this. Yeah, I can see that happening, actually. The number four, like, yeah, that, that drip feed of information is going to make people look at the old one again, the old ones again. All right, I'm going to, I'm going to save. I already saved, but for some reason I'm saving again because I'm a fiend for that. What? There's a shepherd noggin. All right, so that's that's gonna be me for the night, guys. I uh, that was a good run. That was a that was a whole night on the Citadel. Actually, I'm surprised. I I didn't realize that I was just gonna be spending the entire night on the Citadel. Uh, I'm gonna shout out Neon City Daily because. There it is. I could see it pop up. I wasn't sure when it was going to appear. I'm going to shout out Neon City Daily because I think he's going to start streaming some uh, Fortnite Lego soon. Because, you know, he, he seemed to be having a pretty good time earlier on today when I played it with him. Uh, but yeah, that's me for the night, guys. I'm going to take off... Uh, you're in it right now, jeez. Um, I'm, I'll be back later in the week. I've got to, I've got to jump in and finish Metal Gear Solid. I, I, you know, spent most of Monday playing it. Had to call it before I wanted to. Uh, so I'm gonna aim to get back in and finish Metal Gear Solid as soon as I can. Catch around, yeah, yeah. Just pressing buttons at this point in theory, you are tired from what you said. Uh, but yeah, I do Mondays as JRPG, so next Monday I'm going to be back to the, was it the Final Fantasy VII expansion? The Final Fantasy VII Yuffie, Yuffie, like expansion thing. Uh, next Wednesday, obviously, will be more Mass Effect 3, because that's my story night. And like I said, on weekends, it's a pretty fair game, so I'll probably, yeah, I'll probably go Metal Gear this weekend at some point. I think I've got, you know, at least a few hours left in that. Then I might jump to something else. But yeah, thanks so much, guys, for hanging out. That was a really, really good night. I had a lot of fun. Uh, it was great to see some new people in there. Thank you, Anonymous and Neon City Daily for gifting out some subs. Thank you, America Slab, for the follow. And... Oh, Nibble, Nibble rated in, too. Thank you, Nibble. Nibble, Nibble is a cool guy. Nibble... Nivel, I think, is blasting through some uh, uh, Hatsune Miku games at the moment. So he's having a good time with that. So I'm actually kind of keen to check him out when I can next. So, yeah. Thank you so much, guys. I'm going to peace out. See you next time.